my goodness! We are on a level two hype train and I haven't even turned this thing on yet. <laughs> like, what is going on? Choo choo! Oh my goodness, let me see what we got going on here. So, thank you to Jenko for the three month resub, Month the 14 month resub, Nevi for the 15 month resub, Drew for the 10 month resub, and then we've got some biddies. So, we're gonna do get your biddies out, get your biddies out, get your biddies out. Get your biddies out! Thank you to Mum for the 100 biddies, Jenko for the 10 biddies, Romy for the 500 biddies, <laughs> Craig for the 100 biddies. Level 2 hype train, we're 61% through that one and the stream has literally just started, guys. Get your biddies out! Get your biddies out! Get your biddies out! Get your biddies out! Thank you so much, guys! Let's go! Let's go, Drew! 50 more biddies! Get your biddies out! Get your biddies out! Get your biddies out! Get your biddies out! The tiggle biddies! Jeez! Surely moly! What is going on in here now? Jeez! Romeo with the 1,000 tiggle biddies! Get your biddies out! Get your biddies out! Get your biddies out! Get your biddies out! Let's go, <laughs> Jesus! A level three hype train. I've been on, I've been live for about one minute. Whoo! Jenko with the fifty stream streak as well. I'm not good. I'm not good. I'm out of breath. Hey, Quantas. Hey, we got to start the morning with some cheer and some loudness. If you can't be loud in the morning, when can you be loud? If you can't be loud in the morning, when can you be loud? Thank you so much to everyone for those biddies, the love, the resubs, like 15 month resubs coming in like crazy. Mom with the 100 biddies, like crazy, 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 crazy. And yes, we've got Sir Fluffington the third. He is back with us today. He's back with us today, so this is exciting. We've not had Fluff with us for like two TTT seasons. He says, I'm slow when I'm rusty, but who cares? St I start the day with smile, get that shit out of the way first, yeah. <laughs> I feel that. You gotta try to smile. It's Man United coming to the FA Cup and excited to see the match. I will be down at Wembley. Romeo, what are you doing? Get your beardies out. Get your beardies out. Get your beardies out. Get your beardies out. Romeo blowing up the biddies. The itty bitty committee is in session, folks. We are on a level three hype train. Thank you so much for all the love. I will be down at Wembley watching the uh, watching the semi final. I'm very excited. I was I was there when we won four three in the last ten seconds. To see the state of my legs. I can't believe the biddies. The itty bitty committee is in session, guys. This is too much energy and excitement for this early of the day. It's 11 o'clock in the morning, Craig. The day is practically finished. <laughs> we love it. We love it. We all want to be here and be happy and be pumped, no? Scousers are still crying. Best day of my life. My legs are absolutely black and blue. I would show you, but then someone's going to screenshot and do weird stuff with it, I feel so. <laughs> We're now going to be showing the legs today. Get over the biddies, let's get some racing going. Okay, I'm over the biddies. No, I'm not. I'm very grateful for the biddies. But let me tell you what we've got going on today. So we have Brazil week, guys. We have Brazil week. We have Interlagos. Oh! Interlagos in the mini clubman VGT. Watkins Glen Short in the Greddy Fugu. And then Interlagos again, but this time it'll be in the Lexus RCF GT500, and that is the group two. Um, so two very different cars for into Lagos, and then we've got a little break with Watkins Glen with the Greddy, which will be good. It's Brazil themed liveries. It's five points of the best livery on each car, so there's fifteen points in total um, that can be won for having the best livery, which is the equivalent to a race win. So it's really important that people do that all on the liveries. No worries, Mystic. Look forward to having you in the next stream for sure. 
I'll tell my boss today's practically finished town. He says, it is. It's practically over. It's 11 o'clock. <laughs> I'm on the side of TTT, but here for the tiny drama mental racing. Let's go. Jenko, it's not as bad as you think, you know. Oh, let's go. Daniel K with a gifted. Thank you so much, Daniel K. How the bloody hell are you, my friend? How the bloody hell are you? That's gone to Qantas as well. Qantas is in here somewhere. Um... You'll be able to join the next three, won't you, Jenko? Because it's Friday night TCT tomorrow, which you'll be able to join. And it's Easter the next two weeks. You shouldn't be in college. Oh, good, good morning. 6.55 a.m. minus 23 degrees. <laughs> that is savage. Oh, my God. Right. Shall we get some racing on away? The race is going to start. Well, quali is going to start in five minutes. So for anyone who doesn't know what's happening, let me just quickly break it down to you. So we've got a 40 minute racing coming. But first, 10 minutes worth of quali. In that time, we judge the liveries and see what order the grid is going to start in. You're joining tomorrow, Mystic. You're always welcome, honey. So, yeah, make sure you've got the cars. And uh, I'll do the cars for tomorrow at the end of the stream, just so we don't get anyone mixed up with today's stream. Hello, Lord Bingus. Welcome in. How are you doing today, sir? Um, so today you need the Mini Clubman, the Greddy Fugu, and the Lexus RCF, the Group 2. Um, 10 minutes worth of quality, 40 minutes worth of racing. And there is the hype train complete. Choo-choo! Thank you so much, guys. Let's go. Hey, Ashley, thank you so much for the follow. How are you doing today? Welcome into the stream, buddy. Oh, you said this, but Drew got an extra support today. Nice, nice, nice. Drew's got lots of supporters. He's on for a hat trick. He's on for a hat trick. Right, let's get the racing on the way. Let's get the racing on the way. If anyone wants in, you need to add me on PSN. It's Tiny Turn at 13 and you need to get the car and then join in. Once once Quali's gone, it is too late. Doing pretty good. Got the um behind the scenes look at Nate's livery. How have you been? Yes, I've not seen Nate's livery yet, actually, so I will. Yeah, don't worry, Jenko, don't worry. Don't you worry. Don't forget, guys, if you've got 10,000 channel points, you can. Ooh! 13 month resub from Cron. Thank you so much. Cron, how are you doing, your legend? I'm surprised you're, uh, you're not asleep. Well, I'm not because you're always here and not asleep. Thank you so much for the 13 month resub. Um, well, Craig, if I were you, I'd use it on Drew. And I love Drew. We all know I love Drew, but he's going to run away with the championship at the, as, as it stands. So I'd be using it on Drew. But if you actually want a proper giggle rather than a tactical sabotage, I would use it on Fluff. Because Fluff hasn't been here for two seasons and I'm sure he'd appreciate a sabotage because it's unlikely he says that he'll be in front at any point today. Nader Raid is in the group. I will be asleep in a bit. You up for some IRL track driving this summer? I am. I am. Absolutely. I, I'll say it as it is, Rob. I'll say it as it is. Drew needs slowing down and Fluff needs a, a what's it? A welcome back to TTT. Sabo Fluff, yeah, do it. <laughs> <laughs> If you want a laugh, Sabo Fluff. If you want to affect the championship, Sabo Drew. But you, you do what you want. Silverstone is calling my name. Can you imagine me at Silverstone? I feel like I'd be terrible. I'd give it a bloody good go, though. You'd have an instructor, wouldn't you, though? Fred said, if you need to start, go ahead. We're about two minutes from home. No, we'll wait. If he's two minutes from home, we'll wait for Fred. Slow down, Drew, and Fluff needs a what's it. We want drama. We want drama. We want drama. We love the drama. We love the chaos. Hey, DGM, how are you, bloody legend? Good morning, DGM. Hello, Salazari. What's up? What's up? What's up? Thank you for joining us, everyone, Team Red. Thank you all for wherever you're watching, whether it's Team Purple or Team Red, thank you for the love. I really, really appreciate this big start to the stream. We are just waiting on Freddy's two minutes away from home, and then he'll be here. So we are going to wait for Freddy's one of our regulars. Uh, we've got 11 drivers in. We have got room if you want to. Go get yourself the Mini Club from... La, 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 mini Club and VGT. And you can join in. Drama, huh? Mrs. Rome, is there ever a TCT without some sort of drama? Whether it's funny or not funny. 
Yeah, you jumped straight in with the hype train. We didn't get a good morning to lips. There you go. We did miss it from the start. You're right. DGM. Oh, what a hun. We love DGM. Follow DGM if you don't follow DGM. <clears throat> You're trash, so you don't want to see your butt whips. That's fine. Everyone, lurky poos on the red side. Thank you for the lurky poos on the red side. You know I need it. <laughs> <clears throat> Romeo! Oh, Romeo! Wherefore art thou, Romeo? Your better half has redeemed an instant sabo on you, sir. So you will have that wheel spun when the race starts. Running round after a puppy for the last few hours. Now time for work with some turnip carnage in the background. Absolutely. So for anyone who doesn't know what's happened, Mrs. Romeo has just redeemed an instant sabotage um, on Mrs. Uh, from Mrs. Romeo to Romeo. So there's some some relationship drama. We love the drama. Just once it's about 5 a.m. here, but I'll stay up a while longer and watch. Oh, no worries, Lord Bingus. Well, sit back, relax, and thank you so much for lurking for us. And watching as much as you can, of course. Dan has been working, apparently. All I've seen him do is hang around on Twitch. Lol. Hey, he's a super supporter. We need people like this. Yeah, no, my the Salazari, you're welcome if you do want to join us. There's Mr. 30 open tabs at work. I couldn't deal with that. I don't know how you do that. I genuinely don't. I couldn't. Tensions high in the Rome relationship or oh, Rome relationship. Nice. Already is high. Rome is getting punished for all the biddies that he's just showered me with. Just one tab. Okay. If you don't do good morning turnips, then it doesn't feel the same and give you a good energy buzz. I love my little, yeah, I love my good morning turnips. It's how I've got to start every single stream. Good girl, Mrs. Romeo. I know, mum. I know. She's the better half. She's the better half. We're just waiting on Fred. There is a small delay, but it shouldn't be too long. Three stream street for Cron. Thank you, Cron. I appreciate you. You always do turn up. And it's always very late for you. Um, so yeah, Interlagos Mini Club of Invici- Hello Mini Club- Why can't I get my words out? Interlagos Mini Clubman VGT Watkins Glen Short Course in the Greddy Fugu Interlagos in Lexus RCF GT500 Group 2 <clears throat> Shall we do while we're waiting? Freddy is in now. He's just loading into the game. Shall we do a prediction for who's going to win whilst we wait? Who will win? So we've got Drew, Nate, and uh, Jenko's not in. But we've got Fluff in, so I can place Jenko with Fluff. Fred, Mystic's not in. But we've got Damo in, so I could put Damo in. Matt, and then Kitty can be other. Okay, there's a 15 minute prediction up, folks. Go gamble your points so you can get some instant sabos on your friends. Okay, everybody ready for the race? Have we got Naderade? Kitty? Kitty? Uh, Romeo. Oh. Uh, Damo. Drew. Matt. Brad. Fluff. Nevi. Mrs. Romeo. Right, let's go. <clears throat> Quali is starting so we've got five points up for grabs of the best delivery folks so you're gonna have to help me with this already ready and dying a little why are you dying Damo? are you unwell or hungover <laughs> i just saw that nevi said it in the in-game chat he wants to change track 
Nah. We're doing Brazil week. We're staying at Interlagos. <laughs> Got two lots of Interlagos today. We're probably happy there's no Jenko to punty punt today. Oh, we're sad you're not here. No, we're sad you're not here. Okay. Let's get everyone out of the pits and then we're going to start looking at these liveries. You guys, I do need help with the liveries. I've only looked at four so far and they are good. They are very good. I'll let the first lap get underway and then once the order's a bit more settled, we'll go through them. It's tired as hell. Pop po Poppy cat been poorly all night. Now she's see. Oh. Oh, poor little thing. I hope she gets well soon. I'm like 25s back on stream, so if I'm late to chat, that's like, hey, don't worry, don't worry. Jenko is fine. Blame on for ch anyone who got a Brazilian for the occasion surely deserves some extra points. I can neither confirm nor deny. It's all about Hollywood anyway. Romeo talking about the real Ronaldo on his are Same Mystic, you improved blood. Yeah, Mystic, Mystic came out like he was going to be terrible and he's been really, really good. He was like, oh, no, I'm going to be at the back. It's all about Hollywood, baby. Um, right, come on. First lap is going. Then we'll start looking at deliveries. Get your points in. There is a... Um, no, I'm saying Mystic, you said you were going to be terrible and you're actually really good. I'm not saying I said you were terrible, you said you were going to be terrible. But you're actually really good. I was complimenting you, actually. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> Shall we look at some liveries? Okay, so here we go. Brazil themed. We've got Mr. Romeo, see he's got the real Ronaldo number nine. Some say one of the best footballers in the world with the Brazilian football club logo and obviously the Brazilian colors all over. We've got Rogue Energy on the front, Hawker Racing Academy, tiny turnip there as well. And is it sexy time yet on the back window? What do we think? I think that's really, really good. Really impressive livery for Romeo there. <laughs> down the middle of the car. Ew. <laughs> Ew. Right, now we've got Nevi. So we're going to see a lot of Ayrton Senna today. We know that it's Brazil week. It's either going to be Brazilian football or Ayrton Senna, I assume. Nevi's kindly cutting the grass for us. So we've got the, the signature on the side, Ayrton Senna's face, his birth and death date. It's actually 20 years ago, is it? 20 years ago? Brazil we can't it. Why ain't it it? Hey? 30 years. 30 years this year. There we go. Okay, so we've got Fred here now. So we've got another Ayrton Senna here. 96 is 1994, 30 years. Yeah, my maths wasn't mathing there, was it? And obviously the colours of Ayrton Senna in Brazil. No, it isn't. It was Ayrton Senna's birthday today. That's amazing. It's Ayrton Senna's birthday today, guys. That's amazing. Okay, so here's Drew. So you can see on the back of Drew's car, we've got Interlagos. You've got one of Ayrton Senna's cars, and he's got all his little year one and speed of sight and things on the back. Um, so on the side here, we've got the years that he won the championship uh, on the back sort of rear panel, 88, 90 and 91. He's got his birthday and death date as well, which is birthdays today. A Christ Redeemer overlooking Rio de Janeiro. Has anyone been to Rio? We did do a delivery earlier. I didn't realise it was actually his birthday today. I just knew it was close to today. <laughs> <laughs> I knew it was like this week at least. It slipped my mind. Um, oh wow, okay, so look at this. So we've got Ayrton Senna on one side, 30 years, uh, Chrysler Redeemer, 
at Rio de Janeiro, very nice on that side. But then on this side, we've got Pele as well with his uh, World Cup there, Brazilian World Cup as well. Again, one of the best footballers in the world. So that's a lot of detail to the biggest legends of Brazil on this car. Amazing. So Naterade now, we've got Christ the Redeemer. We've got the Brazilian flag. We've got TTT. Nice on the front as well and obviously the appropriate colors so we love to see it kitty here oh wow so kitty's done a brazilian anime car so kitty will always do anime cars but this one is particularly cool because it definitely fits the um oh robbie look robbie we've got rgb on there as well yeah supermod rob runs his own league which kitty kitty does take part in your league right If you only wash my car and only wax the sides, is that class as a Brazilian? It's a car version of a Brazilian, I think. Okay, so Fluffington doesn't have a Brazilian livery because it's joined us late in the day, which is fine. Then we've got Matt Rosewell. So Matt hasn't gone for Ayrton Senna or Pele or any of the Ronaldo or any of them. Gone for Bob's Burgers, which is a Brazilian sort of. Fast and Furious, not Fast and Furious, Fast and Furious, Fast Food, Fast Food. <laughs> it's a Brazilian Fast and Furious burger joint. Yeah, she does, that's why she doesn't put her heels through the place. The way she doesn't put her heels through the place, yeah, 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 yeah. I thought Matt had boobs on his car. No, bobs, bobs, bobs. There we go, Romeo's, we've seen that. Damo here's got the Brazilian colours. The Drew logo on the front. We've got Recipes Paul Walker there as well with Ayrton Senna. Ooh! A car that is not yellow and green. We have Mrs. Romeo's Rio car, which is obviously fitting the Brazil brief. It says on the back, warning, watch out for the uh, idiot behind me. Turn it's just a track day logo. All the little characters on there and her own logo on the back window as well. I like that. Now we've got... Oh, we've seen Nevi's Ayrton Senna. Is that everybody? I've not missed anybody. We've seen Damo. Romeo. Brad. About what? Sorry. Oh! Oh, wow! Right, so on Fred's hood. You know why I went Nos and Kinney went like Nos? It says Nos Amos, TTT, which in Portuguese means we love TTT. So I thought he just put Nos on it, but he's, it says Nos Amos, TTT, which means I love TTT. Red is winning for me, simple but looks like Edson's race helmet, very nice. High cool livery, the blue one, yeah. Right, let's go through it one more time, guys, because I'm actually struggling here. There's some incredible ones. I think I think Drew's is my favourite so far, just due to the detail. We've got Pele on one side, Edson Center on another, but let's see how we go. So there is Naterades. Kitty. Brad. Matt. Romeo's is nice. I think between so far it's between Romeo and Drew. I'm just waiting for these guys to come out the pits. I think it's between Romeo and Drew for me. You want to include Fred? Because it looks like his helmet. Okay. Robbie, can we have a, a poll between... Oh, no, no, I don't want a poll. This is hard. Right, no. I want a poll between Drew, Fred, and Romeo. So these are the cars that we're going to poll between. I 
think Drew's details next level though. That's why I'm stalling. Drew's details crazy guys. But then you've got the simplicity of Fred's. And I like Rome I just like Romeo's. I do just like it. Get your get your get the poll up and let's get your votes in guys. I'll let you guys help me. Whose car shaved the best Brazilian? Get your votes in now, guys. Polls up, get your votes in. So this is Drew. This is Fred. This is Romeo. It's really, really close between all of them, to be honest. So we've got the two more simple cars with Fred and Romeo. But simple doesn't mean bad. Do you know what I mean? Simple doesn't mean bad. So one's Ronaldo. One's Fred. And Drew, who's gone all out on the detail. All out on the detail. That's It's really impressive. Quali is over, guys. So we've got Drew, Matt, and Naterade. That's your top three. <clears> hey, <throat> okay, let's just wait for this poll to finish. And we've got an instant redeem on Mr. Romeo. Don't forget that, guys. The wheel is going to spin immediately on Mr. Romeo. How long is this poll? How long we got left? <clears throat> Drew's is stunning, by the way. I just think friends nailed it. This is the thing. Drew's is details impressive. But then you've got Fred's simplicity. We'll finish the poll, do the points for the best delivery, and then we will get the race underway. So far, we've got three points to Drew, three points to Fred, six points to Romeo. Get your points in. Everyone vote now. Vote now. Get the vote in. Get the vote in. Go, 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 go. The race is about to start. There should just be a thing underneath the thing where you can vote. Last few seconds now. Underneath where the camera is, there should be a thing below me that you can click and press vote. Not long left. You have to be really quick. Romeo's got five points. I'm a Barbie girl. In a Barbie world. Okay, there we go. Let's get the race underway, folks. Good luck, everyone. GG's room. Yeah, it was it was a nice delivery. I liked it from the second I saw it when when I uh, when I was in the lobby with them. So you want I'm blue, da -ba -dee, da -ba -dee, da -ba -dee, da -ba -dee. I am singing again, and. It's free, enjoy it. <laughs> right, let's go. So we've got an instant Sabo here for Romeo. Let's go to Romeo Cam. He's in P7 right now. Let's get the wheel of doom up. It's lights out and away we go. The wheel is spinning. No, you can't. Okay, you need to pit for intermediates at Interlagos. Please, Romeo. Romeo straight into the pits at T1. So Drew is in the lead now. Matt and Fred, they were the people who qualified fastest. Good luck. I'm in class with good luck. Janko, who's your money on, guys? You can also predict who's going to win the race. Gamble some channel points so you can save up and then uh, start giving some instant sabos out once you've got 10,000. 
You wonder why the puppy started howling? I swear to God, DGM. Savage. Absolutely savage. Romeo's picked up a one second penalty here and has Naterade, Mrs. Romeo, Nevi, and Damo at the back. Gamble all. <laughs> Gamble all points. Oh my God, can you imagine? I feel like my camera's a little bit on the low side. Hang on a sec. I might need to just adjust that. Half my head's going to get cut off. Look. That up a little bit. Is that better? I feel like that's a bit better. Oh, right, there we go. I can sit up a bit now. I was slouched in my chair. My boobs just not turned down my mic. That was impressive, eh? Low, 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 low. Right. Matt, Fred. Romeo about to hit the decel penalty line here. The Wheel of Doom is about to spin again because every two minutes we've got a sabotage of the race leader. It's Drew by 1.5 seconds at the moment. Here we go, you ready for this? What can we do to Drew? Romeo's got to pit for intermediates. What have we got for you, Drew? Oh, it's his favorite, I think. Oh, is it gonna creep into the next one? No, it's not. It's not, it's his favorite, this one. He likes to flex. Drew? 360, please. Oh! Yo! Oh! oh! <laughs> Jesus, what have we got going on here? I miss so much chat. I always use body parts of the streamer just for a second. <laughs> just a casual nip to turn down the mic. Hey ho. So Matt has taken the lead here with Fred close in behind. Hey, that was incredible. Drew was the whole day. That was incredible. And the fluff is up in third. The fluff said the fluff was going to be mad. One second penalty picked up by Fred here. We've got Kitty and Drew. Drew down in fifth after doing five 360s. Nate Raid in sixth. Damo chasing in behind. Then we've got Nevi, Mrs. Romeo, and Romeo right at the back having to pit for Inters. Not long until the next sabotage now. Matt, the race leader, point two in front. Two points, an extra two points of degree of, degree, 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 degree of difficulty. That was amazing. I can't believe what just happened. I'll keep shooting as long as I can. I'm in class. Don't worry, Jenko, Jenko. Don't get in trouble or anything like that, honey. Don't don't worry about it. Matt, Fred, the floof. Kitty has claws up in four. Top five, Drew. Now trying to gain some time back. Go back onto the podium. Let's spin the wheel of doom. See what Matt's going to get. Matt, can you please only use fifth gear until the next sabotage? <clears throat> so Matt now needs to drop, oh drop, go up to fifth and stay in fifth for two full minutes. Um, Fred has got a one second penalty in behind and the Fluff is looking to try and scalp as well. So the Fluff actually in position here to go into first and maybe get his first sabotage of TTT in a long time. Kitty right behind, not giving any space, waiting for the accident to happen. Drew's in fifth, the time has dropped, it was two and a half seconds, it's down to one and a half second. Andrew has just gone purple by a tenth there. Um, coming into the final sector now with Naterade right behind as well. We've only got 30 seconds between first and last and that was due to a Romeo pit. One minute until the wheel spins again. You spin me right round, baby, right round. That was honestly so good, I can't wait to clip that. I can't wait to clip that, that's definitely going to be clipped. Do an instant 360, 10 360s later, still going. <laughs> I'm one of these silent wheezing laughers where I actually have genuinely thought I was going to die multiple times from laughing because, like, I lose all the oxygen in my lungs. Genuinely, I laugh so hard. I, I think if I die from laughing, that wouldn't be out of the question. Kitty just got into first. It's side by side here with the fluff. Bluff just edging it. We're going to spin the wheel very soon. 
Very, very close racing here. Fred's got the inside on Fluff. Let's uh, spin the wheel while we see who's going to come out on top. Fluff's got the speed. Fred's got the inside. Who's going to come out? Oh, it's Fred just. It's not good. Brad, you need to reverse for the next two minutes. Brad's right away. Oh, and Fred's hit a wall as a result. Already down to seventh. Brad's got a long two minutes to go now. Kitty's taking the lead with the fluff. Drew and Naterade. This is incredible racing, guys. Look how close it is, but everyone is giving loads of space. We're getting around the corner. Oh, corners nicely. Drew and Fluff with a little side-by-side. -side. Nothing in it, though, whatsoever. Kitty's going to try and pull away here while she's got half the pack right behind her. Drew, Naterade, and Damo. Matt's within touching distance, as is Nevi as well. Really, really close racing. All being led by Kitty as calls. Fastest lap's gone to Drew with a 135.7. Oxygen tank required for Donnie as Rob and I are comedic genius. You won't stop laughing. No, seriously. We're going to have to have some oxygen. No worries, Mystic. Have a lovely day with your mama. And I will see you tomorrow night, hopefully, if all is well. One second gap now for Kitty. Drew and the fluff side by side. One minute till the next wheel spin. Naterade and Matt. Fourth and fifth. Damo trying to take one of the top five spots. Is in within touching distance. Honestly, once I start laughing, guys, that's it. I'm a proper giggler. A proper, proper giggler. <clears throat> I'm like a belly laugher, can't breathe kind of girl. Ugly laugher. You know how you have ugly cryos? I'm an ugly laugher, but I don't care. Okay, let's get the wheel up. It's going to be Kitty. Kitty's pulled away a nice little lead here over everyone else. Drew's moved up into second from fifth. Well, actually from seventh after doing his 15 things that he didn't need to do. You're gonna need an ambulance, good. Good, that's how I like it. Drew and Fluff sounds like innocent kids TV show and not so innocent adult show. I'd, I'd go for the latter with these two, honestly. Wheel of Dune has spun. Kitty, can you drop to the back of the grid, please? You are, you are allowed to go the wrong way around if you, yeah. But just keep, keep over to the side. Okay, Drew, Naterade and the Fluff. Kitty has got to go to the back, which at the moment is Fred, who is 1.7 minutes behind with a three-second penalty. So Kitty's one-point-second lead has caused nothing for her, really. That is one of the worst sabotages you can get, and it's come early into the race. So Kitty can at least catch up. We're not even... Uh, we're not even a quarter of the way through yet. Drew and Naterade here, side by side. Naterade looking to claim another win. We had two wins last week for Naterade, yeah? That's one of the worst sabotages by a long, long way. Fluff is in amongst it with Nevi and Mrs. Romeo in fourth and fifth. They're side by side. Mrs. Romeo's picked up a half second. Nevi's gone wide in that corner there. Mrs. Romeo has got the pen though, so she'll have to open up as much space as possible away from Nevi. Then we've got Damo and Matt in the pits. Romeo obviously playing catch up from having to pit for inters and pit for uh, normal tyres because the inters got shredded. Drew, oh, Drew's picked up a one second here. Drew's picked up a one second, only five tenths ahead of Naterade. Decel line incoming. Naterade will take the lead, but sabotage is incoming. Naterade might drop straight back and lose a play, so let's see. We'll spin the wheel, but I think it's... Well, it is going to be Naterade's, but where's Fluff in all this? Four seconds back. Ooh, it depends on what the sabotage is. It's not too bad. It's not too bad. We'll, we'll give it out on the two-minute mark, just so we don't affect the race too early. Naterade! Fifth gear only, please. The Naterade has to stay in fifth for the next two minutes. Drew has just served its penalty. Mrs. Romeo has moved up into third. The Fluff has pitted. Mrs. Romeo has got eight seconds to find and that time is going down at the moment. We've got uh, Nevi in the pits, Damo and Matt here in sixth and seventh. Where Kitty has Claws who went to the back. Romeo and Fred. Has Kitty got all the way to the back and back up to eighth again? That's impressive. Fred right, right, right at the back. One minute five behind. 
Drew's tyres are looking a little bit short on that front right. He's got no tread on it whatsoever. Nate Ray trying to impact on him. Don't forget, guys, if you've got 10k channel points or 20k channel points, you could do an instant sabotage on any driver at any point in the race. Sorry, I'm about to sneeze. I'm just trying to stop it by, like, squeezing my nose. MMGT, nice. So finally watched one live. Welcome in. How you doing? Howie Potter. Welcome over from Twitter, honey. How you doing? Good. Well, it'd be good morning for you, right? Good morning. Good morning. Hello, hello, hello. Thank you so much for joining us today. I have more than enough for instant sab, but I'm saving it for my lunch break. Okay, okay, okay. That's fine. We've got another sabotage coming in 15 seconds anyway, so don't worry too much. Drew's opened up two and a half on Naterade here with Mrs. Romeo, who's dropped the eight and a half down to seven. So she's playing catch up as well. Get the wheel of doom. 7.30 a.m. What have you got planned for today, Howie? Other than joining us, of course, which I'm so grateful for. Drew, what have we got? What have we got, honeys? Okay, it's ooh, it's not, it's not, it's not good, shall we say? I'm glad, I'm glad to have you, honestly. I know we've like interacted so much. Handbrake only, please, Drew, for the next two minutes. So Drew now can only race with a handbrake for the next two minutes, and we're gonna keep all eyes on Drew to make sure there is no normal braking inputs. You're just, oh, you're at work already? God, you start early. What do you do if you don't mind me asking? You don't have to answer if you don't want to, of course. So Drew has no tyres and is on handbrake only. Has got a 35 second lead at the moment. So let's see if we can slow him down. He's got no tyre wear. He's got a 35 second lead, but he's only got handbrake. A records clerk. You must start super early then. Super early. That's crazy. Yeah, no, thank you so much for popping in. I know we see each other on Twitter all the time, but it's nice to, like, see you over here. Try and return the favour when I can. Aussie Pride, how you doing? How you doing? We're currently on Drew Cam here, who's got handbrake only for the next two minutes, and we're not going to leave Drew Cam because it's just funny to watch someone sliding around. But he's flexing a little bit, to be honest. You haven't had your cuppa yet? I've just had mine. I'm on water now, but I'll make another coffee in between races, to be honest. Mark's in second. The 35 second lead is down to 27 already. The handbrake is slowing him down. He's going to have to... Oh! Not going to pit. That's an interesting choice. Very interesting choice. Here comes the big T1. The T1... Oh my... Drew, that was pretty impressive, honey. If I do say so myself, I can't do that with normal braking. <laughs> they see me rolling. They hate it. Patrolling and trying to catch me red and dirty. Right, Matt is closing down the time. Damo is on the podium right now and we're going to spin the wheel. It's going to be Drew who's getting stacked on. We need something bigger for Drew. <laughs> Gets you flustered. I know, me too. Okay, Drew, you need some tyres, so go get some wets, please. Drew's got to change his tyres now for wet tyres. I love it sideways. I love it backwards. I love it always. I love Gran Turismo. We all love Gran Turismo. I think it's what, like got to be up there with one of the best graphics ever, surely. Surely. So Matt now really closing in this gap and will potentially take the lead. Well, we'll, poten well, we'll take the lead. How long's the pit here from start to finish? Be working his way around. No tire wear whatsoever. 19 seconds is the gap. Yo, Wadero. How are you doing? Nice to see you, legend. Naterade in the top three. Two seconds behind him. We've got Damo, the fluff, Mrs. Romeo. And then there's a little battle here, look, between Fred, Mrs. Romeo, and Nevi. So we'll keep all eyes on them. Drew doing a hawker drift. No, seriously, that was considering he had no tire wear and he had handbrake only. That was impressive. The other cars for today, we've got the Greddy Fugu at Watkins Glen Shaw, and we've got the Lexus RCF GT500 Group 2, and that'll be back at Interlagos. We've got two Interlagos. We are Brazil themed, so you know we've got to we've got to use the Brazilian track. We thought we'd break it up with Watkins Glen being an American track and being covered by the Americas. 
but we wanted to, we were nearly stayed with Interlagos the whole day, but we thought it may get a little bit boring for the guys and girls. Drew now getting his wet tyres on. Matt has moved in to the lead. Uh, Naterade will take second, and Damo will uh, yeah Damo will take third. Drew's fueling up as well. We don't want Drew to run out of fuel. We've got the next sabotage incoming now, folks. Yeah, don't worry, Howie. Go get go get yourself a brew and come back. Oh dear. Matt, you need to reverse for the next two minutes, please. There goes Matt. Matt is round. He's a bit wet for TTT, aren't we all? Is that, is that another thing? You were here before you, Qantas? Matt got oofed. Matt got oofed and Naterade moved into the lead. Matt's got to go backwards for two full minutes, which is not easy. Damo's moved into second. Then we've got Fluff. Fluff's going to move into the podium spots. Drew trying to catch up here, having put wet tyres on. Mrs. Romeo, Fred with a 1.5 as well. I'm assuming that's from hitting a wall. Matt's right of way. If you hit him, that's on you, not him. Romeo coming in now. Finally works his way up into eighth spot. And Kitty, 29 seconds behind, playing huge catch-up. No price for coming first just for being a legend. Yeah, there's definitely no price coming first. Naterade 9.5 seconds in the lead. Damo and the Fluff, that's your podium. Fluff honestly made out like he was going to be terrible. And Fluff has pretty much been in amongst it for the whole race. So this is what seems... I'm not listening to anyone now who says, can I join TTT but I'm going to be terrible because it's nonsense. Absolute nonsense. We've got a Canadian and two Brits on the podium. Then we've got an Aussie and a Dutch man in the top five. Got the next wheel of doom incoming. It's gonna be Naderade. Yeah, I know he loves my voice. I know he loves my voice. <clears throat> We're a bit early, so I'll wait another five seconds and then I'll tell him because we don't want to impact the race in any way. Naderade. Racing hearts, please. Oh, you should come in, Aussie. You should come in. We've got the room. You should come in. It'd be nice to have you. We've not had you for a little minute. Not that I'm going to like bear. Hey, e Razor, how you doing? Welcome in all the way over on Team Red. I appreciate you being here. How's things going for you today? The Naterade, 12.8 seconds in the lead. Bolt has to pit for racing hard tyres. H2O. You dead? What are? Where are you? Where have you been all my life? What are you? Need to get in here as well. Drew, Fred, Nevy side by side. Nevy's got the inside line here. Little bump there. Mrs. Romeo and Matt. Matt's fifty-six seconds behind after having to reverse for two full minutes and now playing catch up. Naterade in the pit, getting racing hard tires. So it'll be Damo and Fluff and Kitty moving to the podium spots. Thank you so much for swinging by, Razor. What have you got planned with your day today? Where are you up to in your day today? Where, where are you from? Earning the dollars. Well, I can't complain of that. You need to earn those, uh, earn those monies, honeys. Earn those monies. It's a tough world out there at the moment. All right, Wheel of Doom. Here is the Wheel of Doom. We've got Damon. What Sabo is your favorite, guys? If you could pick a Sabo, what would it be? What is your favorite? I think for me it's the reverse one. I just think it's always funny. Bluff has moved into the lead. The wheel of doom's about to spin. Well, we've got one tomorrow night, which will be early morning for you, Water Arrow, if you want to join in a separate one. Just about to start lorry driving. Oh my god, we'll drive safe, honey. And uh, hopefully I'll see you soon. <clears throat> Ham Handbrake only is your favourite. 360. Oh, I love a 360. Bluff. Pit for racing hard tyres, please. Um, I love the 360s as well. That's probably my second favourite as well because obviously that can bring drama or flex. So it's like good whether it goes bad or good. Handbrake only is good. It depends on the track though. So that's why I'm not putting it as my favourite because it does depend on the track. Because you've got tracks with huge straights. It's not the best. 
That's today morning for us. Yeah, Aussies, there is one in the morning for you if you want to come and join us. Saturday morning, not Friday morning. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Razor. Last lap, off to the back. Lol, so unlucky. Yeah, yeah. That one's savage. I tell you, I did some handbrake only laps at what close. It's so fun around it, yeah. If you get the right track, it's not that bad. Yeah, yeah, it's not It's not that bad if you get the right track. But I think my favourite's reverse because it's just funny and then the 360s are good as well. The pit ones are good for, like, losing time but they're not, they're not as interesting to watch, I guess. Drop to the back, I just feel like I've killed someone. I feel awful. Kitty, look at this, right? So Kitty, early into the race, about eight, nine minutes into the race, had to drop to the back, which was one minute, seven seconds behind the... The pack is now 1.8 seconds in the lead. Kitty also has the fastest lap with a 129.8. That is mega impressive to go right to the back and now be two seconds in the lead. Fred's in second here. Kitty's picked up a half second cutting pen. Damo and Romeo side by side. Romeo's moved his way up from 10th to 3rd, so that's cool as well. We've got the next Sabo coming in as well. Gonna be kiddies. Oh yeah, for sure. It's like it's literally less than like three tenths of a second, but it is what it is. Kitty, can you box for medium tires, please? New mediums. It's a straight to the back. It's funny watching people go the wrong way together. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It is funny, and it, but it is savage. It is definitely savage. Like the last lap of the race, you think you're about to win, go to the back. <laughs> You've just worked for 40 minutes to get told you've just lost the race. <laughs> it's just so mean. It's just so unnecessarily mean, but I love it. Romeo on the podium spots now. Dropping the time on Fred quite quick. What's Fred done? Has Fred made a mistake? The Fred was drop the Fred. The, the time was dropping rapidly there. Romeo's about to move up into second. And uh, Damo into third here. Fred, the new race leader, with 3.6 seconds in the lead. Hello, Cle Hello, Calibraman. How are you doing, my friend? I mean, to pit on the last lap when it's close, finish feels savage. Yeah, but that always brings the drama. That's always like you've got like three cars, they've all like close, and all three are gonna get a sabotage, and then the pit happens. It's like yeah. Drew doesn't do three sixties. He does like ten eighty ollies. Go Romeo, you're supporting Romeo. Romeo's in second right now. Anything can happen at any point, but as long as you're willing to take it on the chin, then we're all good. We've got six drivers all all within chance of winning this race so far. It has been pretty close, the racing. Drew is trying to make his way back. He's got four seconds to find, and the floor's got 20 seconds to find. So it has opened up quite a lot towards the back of the pack, but the top six is really, really close. Next sabotage incoming. And it's gonna be... What's... Why is that there? Fred, racing mediums, please. The Fred has to pit. Racing mediums. If that's not edited with Tony, her points counter drew. I'm gonna be disappointed. I won't lie. I need to figure out how to do that. That's like a bit above my pay grade. A bit above my pay grade on the old editing, but I'll give it a go. I can, can neither confirm nor deny. I may have just eaten one of the Easter eggs I bought for the kitchen. You know what? I've done that so many times. I bought Easter eggs and eaten them before Easter and then had to buy more Easter eggs. It's, yeah, it's just the done thing. It's just the done thing. Mrs. Romeo up in fourth now. Let's get it, Mrs. Romeo. Dad tax, yeah, for sure. Hey, Calibraman, how's things? How are you doing today, honey? Thank you so much for stopping by the stream. Okay, we've got another sabotaging coming in one minute. Romeo is the race leader in the Ronaldo car. Picked up five points for the best livery. Naterade is in second. Demo is in third. Romeo leading the way here. So Romeo is already five points better off this race and is leading the race. So what can we do? What can we do to slow down our own? If anyone is slowing down, it's Drew. But Drew is at the back, somewhere near the back at the moment. So that's okay. Calibramon with the two-month resub, thank you. 
Two month prime resub. Let's get it, Calibraman. Thank you so much for the support, honey. I appreciate all the love today, guys. I've been spoilt rotten. No, I'm not gonna commentate his cursing, but I've gotta be fair, he's in the front. I've gotta I've gotta give him his screen time. Here comes the wheel of Doom. Oh shit. Oh shit. Romeo, drop to the back. But it's early. <laughs> no, <laughs> it's early enough into the race. He's got ten minutes to play catch up. Where is last place right now? Forty-eight seconds behind. Right. Hang on a second. Kitty got from one minute seven behind to first in 12 minutes so he can get back up there he can get back up there damon now the race leader mrs romeo up in second with 12 seconds on kitty has claws you're not going to cause this but you have have this instead i know no Qantas' skill isn't to stay in second place because when the one minute sabos come in you can't stay in second you're working hard at the manufacturers. Fair play. Hey, Barbie. How you doing, honey? How you doing, Bobs? Be Bobs. Bobster. Barbie. Bob. Damo, the new race leader. Is this the first time Damo's been in the race lead already today? Mrs. Romeo, very, very close. And Kitty's dropped the 12 seconds down to nine. Kitty's still with the fastest lap here, so we'll look to try and take. Just at work. How's work going for you today? Wheel of Doom's gonna spin again. It's gonna spin again. It's gonna be Damo's. I have to give Damo's out a little bit early because Damo's not in the um, group chat. So I'll give Damo's out in about seven seconds. <gasps> oh! The wheel is being mean. Damo, you need to drop to the back. That is all three drop to the backs have happened. Demo has... Oh, I don't know. That looked like Demo, no? Oh, let me... But I have to give out Demo's early because he's not in the channel. So I gave it out five seconds early. Mrs. Romeo was first on the minute, the chat is saying. But I have to give out Demo's early, so what do I do? It's going to Demo because I have to give it early. So Demo can drop to the back. <clears throat> I gave it as Demo. Yeah. It's hard, that one. Kitty has claws now in front here. Mrs. Romy has picked up a half second. Yeah, no worries, Demo. No worries. The fluff, Matt, Fred, Natorade. Natorade well wide there. We've got... Another sabotage coming in one minute. Four seconds is the gap. Mrs. Romeo is being chased down by the fluff now. Matt, Fred, and Natorade. Then we've got Drew, Nevi, Damo, and Romeo. One minute 23 behind. Damo's trying to have to go all oh, look at this. Damo's going slow. Damo's going well slow. Romeo's coming round the first turn now. Where's Demo? Quite a long way still to wait. Mr. Dream is being chased down by the fluff. <laughs> so Fluffington the third. Here we go, here we go. Demo could probably start getting on the gas now. There we go. Kitty has claws. The wheel of doom is spinning. What's it gonna be? Kitty, you need to lose a place, please. Kitty has got to drop to second. And the fluff will take the lead. But Kitty can time it so she is back on the gas fast enough to take first back as well. Literally just has to go into second. Here comes the fluff. 
Kitty's going to try and time it nice so that she'll regain the lead if possible. But we'll see. Kitty back on the gas. Gone into second and back into first. The fluff has gone back into first. Yeah. Drop the place. But very much not giving fluff any time here. Mr. Drew, come on, Drew, you speedy boy, go. Nevin Drew in the best position for a dub. Mrs. Romeo's up there. Mrs. Romeo's up there. We've got the one minute Sabo's coming in soon as well. Naterade. Oh, Fred's picked up a two second penalty here, as is Matt with a half second both hitting the D cell line now. So Drew will move up into fifth. Kitty Fluff and Mrs. Romeo, your top three. Kitty's regained the lead here. And the fluff, look at this, we're not going to be able to call it between these two. Wheel of Doom coming up here as well. Who's it going to be? Okay, it's a nice one. Here's a nice one. Oh, well done, Jenko. Nice one. Nice one. Kitty, stop, stop. Yo, Calibraman with the two gifted. Let's go, Calibraman. Thank you so much for those two gifted. Who did they go to? It's not Tommy who they went to. Calibraman with the two gifted subs. Thank you so much, honey. The Fluff is now the new race leader. Thank you for the shout outs. Kitty's in second. Nater is in third. Then we've got Drew, Fred, and Nevi. Matt and Mrs. Romeo in the pits. Mrs. Romeo, thank you for doing the shout out there. We got Romeo and Damo, one minute 12 behind. Romeo already gained a place back though, so that's good. LCK Racing and Big T get the gifted. Nice, nice, nice. LCK, LCK Racing is good for the old What's It as well. WRC. We need to do a WRC stream soon. I've got the game, I'm not playing it. I've refused to play it until I've got Rob and DGM by my side. I refuse to play it until I've got one of them, well, both of them to be by my side, to be honest. The one minute sabotages are coming in now. So from 34 minutes to every one minute. To, to anybody new, the sabotages will be one minute long now. So if you get something, you only have to do it for one minute. Super sabs incoming. This is where you can't, you can't really be that strategic because you could risk losing too much space. My Italian friend is crazy. Yeah, I've got WRC. I just need to have a go at it. I'll be terrible, though. <laughs> I'll tell you in a minute, Rob. Let me just start spinning the wheel. So, Fluffington the third. So, Fluffington the third. Stop, start, please. Rob will tell you all the different types. Bark on the trees, he's hit, and I'll be useful. Okay, okay. You haven't bought it yet? I'm excited to give it a go. So which side do I want? I think I want DGM to my left-hand side and Rob behind me. So DGM in the passenger seat and Rob in the, in the back giving instructions. <clears throat> We've got another wheel spinning coming now. You'll get stacked again. Oh, bloody no. Good morning, Diego. How are you doing, honey? The wheel has spun. Yeah, you can just start. Yeah, there to translate. It's going to be Kitty. Kitty, you need to pit for racing hard tyres, please. The King D D42 with a nine month resub. Thank you so much for that resub, honey. How are you doing today? I'm really good. Thank you so much for asking. No problem, no problem, Kaliban. Thank you so much for the gifted and for the gift and, uh, and for your own resub as well. Miss Ashley, how are you doing, honey? Everyone's good. Everyone's in good spirits. Everyone is pumped right now. 
Kitty's gonna get stacked. Kitty is gonna get stacked. Naterade's in second. Then we've got Fred in third. Drew in fourth. And Nevi in fifth. Who's your winner, folks? Who is your winner? Wheel of Doom is spinning on. Kitty has claws. Drew is poised. Drew is poised right now, actually. Uwek! 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 Kitty, you need to reverse for one minute, please. All good, thank you. Waiting for waiting for Fred to get back. Oh no, of course, of course, of course. When it's like five minutes, it's okay. Your money's on double champ, literally. We'll see, we'll see. Naterade has moved into the lead. Kitty is in reverse. We've got Fred's gone up into second and Drew will try and take third in a second. The wheel's gonna keep spinning every one minute till the end of the race. <laughs> miss you. Right, here we go, here comes the wheel. Naterade six seconds in the lead. Got plenty of fuel, plenty of tire wear at the moment. I say this, look what's just come up. Tornado Raid. Nader Raid's gonna get stacked on. Nader Raid is in a bad position here. Nader Raid, you need to pit for wet tires, please. So Nader Raid's gonna get stacked. Seven seconds is the gap now to Fred. Then we've got Drew in third, Nevi in fourth, and Matt in fifth. Little battle between Nevi and uh, Matt here, so we'll keep all eyes on that. Drew, I think, is poised for a win, though. I think Drew's poised for a win. Matt has just gone into fourth here. Now trying to close down the time. Got a wheel spinning coming. Crazy about to happen. We want the madness. Bring the madness. Guys, if you've got 10k channel points, spend them. Now is the time. Yes, sir. Is Naterae going to pit? No, Naterae is not going to pit. This is an interesting stack on Nate here. Naterae, when you come out of the pit, you're going to have to lose a place. It's an interesting one because he's not going from first to second. He'll go from wherever he ends up in the pit, coming out the pit, to there. So it could be like sixth to seventh. I'll keep you on tab while I eat breakfast. Thank you so much for that tab, Diego. What are you having for breakfast? Yeah, no worries, Howie. Thank you for the tabs. All the tabs are very much appreciated. Naterade in the pit getting his wet tires. Fred in second. So we're gonna I'm going to stay on Naterade actually for the pit. Actually, no, because we need the Wheel of Doom. Let me think. Let me cook. Fred's in first. We'll get the next Sabo, which is going to be another pit. Is it? Yeah, just, 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 just. Pancakes, eggs and bacon. Oh my god, a hearty breakfast there for you, Diego. I love it. Fred, you need to box for Inters, please. Fred needs to box for Inters. So Fred is having... Uh, Nato is having to wait for Kitty. Not good for Naterade there. That's his race pretty much over. Fred's got to box for Inters. It's going to be either Fred or Drew. I think it's going to be Drew. Maybe Matt as well. Matt's within it. I'm going to spin the wheel ready because we're not. it's going to be really close to the line, the final sabotage here, if not just before. Oh, it's another pit. This is interesting. I don't think he's going to get in the pits in time. I don't think he's going to... I think he's just going to get told to pit and that's it. He's not going to get in the pits in time. It's going to be... It's going to be Drew, I think. Ooh. Okay. The next one is pit for Inters. So it's a double pit, yep. Yeah. So there goes Fred into the pits. Drew, Fred has won! Fred has won! Drew's taken second. Matt has taken third. The the pit, the, the finish line is that close to the pit entry. Fred nicked it. 
Drew has taken second, and Matt has taken third. Mrs. Romeo has taken fourth. Then we got the fluff. Romeo, Nevi, Kitty, Naterade, and Damo ended up right at the back. Unlucky Damo there. The, the, the line is so close to the pit entry that Fred just nicked it. Well, actually, didn't just nick it. Five tenths nicked it. So let's manage the prediction. We had 1.1k channel points on Fred over two people. Enjoy your points, folks. Enjoy your points. Let's give out the... Uh, let's give out the results here now. Hogger. 4.7k going to Hogger and Naterade. GG's on your correct prediction. Okay, so it's going to be 15 points to Fred. 14 points to Drew. 13 points to Matt. 12 points to Mrs. Romeo. 11 points to Sir Fluff. I need to add Fluff to my list. 10 points to Romeo. 9 points to Nevi. 8 points to Kitty. 7 points to Naterade. 6 points to Damo. GG's folks, we're going to change on to Watkins Glen now. You want the G ready Fugu. Where's Watkins? Where's Watkins? Where's Watkins? There is Watkins. The short course, right? Yeah. Right, lobby is changing over now, folks. So close. I know Jenko was cheering him on the whole way down. And that's what baby Elsa sabotaging. Oh. Oh. Baby Elsa. She's so cute. I love listening to her little cries. We need Matt to leave. Right. I'm going to make a quick coffee, folks. I need a new drink. And um, I will be right back. Keep the chat a popping for me, folks. You can get another prediction underway if you want for the next race. Um, and I'll be right back with you in about five minutes once the kettle's boiled. You need the G-Ready Fugu and we are at Watkins Glen Short. Let's get another prediction underway.
Okay, folks, we are back. How's everybody doing? Get your predictions in. Who's Who knows the Glen better than any other? Who knows the Glen better than any other? I'm going to guess that this race win will go to... I'm gonna go for Fred. I'm gonna go for Fred for the race win. I'm just looking at the, the 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 different drivers. I'm gonna go for Fred for the race win. That's my guess. I'm not gonna predict, obviously, because that would be probably not the done thing. A two hundred of mine. Shall we see where the predictions have got us so far? So a thousand channel points have gone on Drew. A hundred have gone on Romeo. Get your predictions in, folks. Get them in. What time is it now? Four minutes until the race will uh, get going. If you, I know, I have all the turnips. I have all the turnips. Put your turnips in. We've got all sorts of points going on here. Drew, Fred, and Romeo. The only three though. Who's your race winner, guys? You can get some instant sabos if you gamble your ch gamble your channel points. Right, I've reset the wheel and I think I'm good to go. So I'll give the racers a couple more minutes just to freshen up, and then we'll get we'll we'll head off to track. We'll watch quali, pick the best livery again. I went to um, I had my first ever personal training session on Tuesday morning, guys. Oh, I got hit in the face by a brick. This woman's legs, this woman's legs would kill a man. Let me show you a picture. This woman's legs would kill a man. This is my personal trainer's legs. I walked in thinking like, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm odd. I'm odd, you know? Jesus Christ. I nearly walked back out. Da -da! How you doing, honey? No, you wouldn't want them as ear. My legs, maybe. Mine, mine have got a lot of cushion. <laughs> um... This woman's legs would kill you. They would strangle you to death. That's my personal trainer. So I, yeah, I walked in and I nearly walked out. I'm good, thanks, here you are. Hey, Venom, how you doing? I can, I can confirm they are absolutely not my legs. <laughs> They're my personal trainer's legs. <laughs> my legs have got far too much cellulite for that. No, my legs definitely have cellulite. <laughs> yeah, there, there was that issue as well. I'm surprised none of you noticed that there was a race race difference. <laughs> I'm really, really, really good. Thank you so much for asking. We're gonna get the race underway now. Right, let's change scene. We're gonna get the uh, we're gonna get the race started. Naderade, Kitty, Romeo, Demo, Drew, Matt, Brad, Fluff, Nevi, Mrs. Romeo. Mrs. Rowe? She's muted. Unmute. Tiny do gym stuff, so we need tiny gym on vlogs. I will I could do some gym stuff on the vlogs if you'd like. I'm definitely not doing it with my personal trainer, I just embarrass myself. 
So far gone with the 17 months. Now this is my longest ever sub. My longest ever sub right there, ladies and gentlemen. 17 month resub from So Far Gone. Thank you so much. All is really, really well. How's things with you, So Far Gone? 17 months. We're nearly like, like two years in coming, eh? Where's Mrs. Romeo? Is she falling asleep? This is why we do the roll calls, by the way. Everyone laughs at me for doing it, but this is why. You want a dancey dance? Can I have a dancey dance? All right, Quali is starting, guys. You're getting this game next month, Venom. I hope, I hope you'll come and join us. Here we go, here we go. Quali is underway now. 10 minutes Quali, 40 minutes of race. You are the OG. Good, I'm glad to hear you well. Um, Dak Dak, my voice was fine, my legs weren't, my thighs from my knee to my mid thigh is black and blue. I, nuts. Best day ever. You saw Dancy Dance. <laughs> Bam! Dak Dak had to retire from TTT for this season, at least. Dancy Dance was completed twice, in fact, because, you know, I don't like to disappoint people. I'm going to let the first two laps go here so I can do the uh, liveries without any problems. Don't forget, guys, you can still predict who's going to win the race with your channel points. Make sure you do. It's well worth doing. Right, what have we got going on? Yeah, but you could get your points for the 10k, Rob. Go big or go home, honey. Go big or go home. Put it all in. See, I'm a, I'm a, I'm put everything on on black kind of girl. Like I am. I I I definitely live life risky. Thank you for starting the prediction. Yeah, P2 last season. I live life on the edge. I'm definitely a gambler by nature. Right, shall we start looking at the liveries, folks? So we've got Brazil week as Matt hits the wall. Okay, so Matt has got Devassa. What is Devassa? Matt, what is Devassa? Did you see that? Did you see that? Jenko is at work. Right, start again. But we'll go back to Matt because now my order's all changed. So we've got Romeo here. We've got Christ the Redeemer on the front. We've got the um, Brazilian skyline there as well, looking over Rio de Janeiro. The flag. I love these cars. I think they look so cool. Christ the Redeemer on the back as well. Very nice. Then we've got Drew here. Oh my god. Goodness, Drew is gone for carnival here. So we've got some of the Rio characters and then some carnival ladies here as well. We've got the turnip uh, turnip logo on the roof. Some more lovely um, ladies. Already mentioned. And Brazil carnival there. Oh, I love that. I love that. Your man bunny hot that? I've never seen anything like it. 
Now we've got Naderade. So we've got some Brazilian football teams here. So you're going to have to tell me who each of these are. So hang on, let me think. So that one on the, that one must be Sao Paulo, Sao Paulo FC. And that one must be, oh, this is going to drive me mad. That's got to be Sao Paulo. Hmm. Fluminense, Fluminense, or Flamengo, is it Flamengo? Is it Flamengo or Fluminense? Fluminense. Flamengo, Flamengo, Flamengo. Oh, I've got Sao Paulo. Okay, so Fred, we've got the Rio 2016 Olympics. That's a nice thought with the Interlagos track there. Christ the Redeemer overlooking Brazil. The Senna colours as well. And the Brazilian fact with the Pele overhead kick. Very nice. Lots of touches there from Fred. Flamengo, yeah. So then we've got Mrs. Romeo with the carnival as well. The fireworks popping off. We love all the colours on these. I was hoping that we'd have some carnival cars because they're just amazing. We've got fireworks, bunting, carnival ladies. Then we've got Neve well, with the Palmeiras football team which is a green football team as you can see by their logo you've also got the Copa Libertadores on the side as well this is cool this is different I quite like this one I quite like this one Bluff hasn't got liveries today we're waiting for Demo to come out now so we've got Demo with the yellow and green turn it's just a track day Toretto's customs as well anything on the back there I don't want to miss any details Kitty here, we've got the yellow and green and blue from Kitty, the Brazilian colours with the anime as well. So fit the theme and her own theme as well. So what do we think, folks? Have we seen Romeo? We have seen Romeos, right? Yeah, we have seen Romeos. Matt, Stavassa here. That's where we were when we got cut off from him bunny hopping. Lots of, lots of Brazilian colours and themes in there. I think for me it's between Nevi and Drew. Between Nevi and Drew. So I think Drew's carnival. Hmm. I'm just waiting for Drew to come out the pits here. Hang on. I want to have another look through Nevi and Drew. Right. Drew's carnival car. Or Nevi's Palmeiras car. What do we think, folks? What do we think? No worries, Robbie. No worries. What do we think, guys? I'm really, really stuck here. Should we do a poll? Very different cars. Very, very, very different cars. Huge amount of detail on Drew's again. Oh, do we do a poll? I'm going to do a poll. Between Drew and Nevi. Pick your favourite livery, not your favourite driver. We Drew and Nevi. We'll do it for one minute. 
Right, there we go, guys. Get your votes in now. Get them in now. Quick, 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 quick. So we've got Nevi here. Or Drew. So, oh, Nevi's gone in the pits. Nightmare. So this is Drew's. Nevi's with the green Palmyra S car. It won't be help. Uh, it's probably too late now by the time you've got out, to be honest. I think everyone saw it because I was flicking between you two for ages. Okay. Just quickly coming out. What do we think? So there's Nevi. Drew. Five points to Drew. I'll place a foot, but I'll check into the race here. There, no worries, Junker. No worries, mate. So Quali has ended with Kitty, Drew, and Romeo. Mm-hmm. Mm. Should be. Oh, it should be there. Oh, it's already finished, yeah. It was... So we've got Drew with 5.5k channel points with five different drivers voting on Drew to win. Romeo with one vote and Fred with one vote. They're both nice. You should... you... <laughs> Mom! The liveries has to be, the liveries has to be based on the actual right livery. <laughs> but I hear you, I know why you did it. So the winner of the day so far by four points is Drew with 19 and then it's a joint second with Romeo and Fred on 15 points, Mrs. Romeo. Oh, yeah, your poll, your poll. Yeah, I haven't put that in. Yeah, thank you. Kitty for this one as well. Let me not get that one done. Fastest quality for Kitty. Right, okay, start again. So 20 points for Drew. And then 15 points for Romeo and Fred. And then 13 points for Matt. 12 points for Mrs. Romeo. Bye, Jenny. So, yeah, that is... So far, overall, we've got Drew is the only driver to have broken 300 points. He's on 336 points. Second place is... Oh, no. Mrs. Romeo has. She's got 311. So, Drew, 336. Mrs. Romeo, 311. We've got 10 seconds left while this cools down and then we'll be going on straight into the race. Okay, we're going straight away. Who? Who's not ready? Drew, Drew got the livery points. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No worries. It's uh, oh, have you already added me? Cool. Sorry, I misread what you said. I thought you said I'm, I'm adding you, not I've added you. Okay, here we go. This isn't the best angle, is it? This is definitely not the nicest angle. So we'll go with. Where should we go? Just in the middle of the pack? Go to Matt Cam? Q1. 
Kitty drew in Rome on the front of the grid. Oh, Fred jumped it. Fred jumped the start. Mrs. Romeo's going to gain a free place there. Look at this three wide drag down the, the uh, home straight into team one. We'll take it easy going through there. Oh, a bit of a wiggle there. Everyone's okay. Well done, everyone. Well done, everyone. Nevy's picked up a half second cutting pen. You've added me. I'll have a look after the, the race, Vemma. Kitty, Romeo and Drew now. It's going to be some close racing, I think, again in these cars. They don't open up the biggest skill gap in that sense. Don't forget, if you've got 10k channel points, you can do your thing. Nadarine, Matt, Mrs. Romeo, Nevy's got the penalty to serve. Damo has fallen behind here. What's happened to Damo? Kitty point six in front. Brad, the fluff with Matt chasing and Naterade as well. Oh, who just went wide there? Was that Mrs. Rome? Unlucky Mrs. Rome. Kitty and Drew. Both very, 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 very fast drivers. Kitty set the time with a 122.5 on the outlap. And the Wheel of Doom is about to be spun. Ew, heck. Kitty. Handbrake only, please. So we're going to keep all eyes on Kitty for the next two minutes. Make sure Kitty is only using handbrake. She cannot use any regular braking. It shouldn't be too dramatic on this course. Yeah. You're scared on it. What, of the game or of joining TTT? So there goes Kitty well wide. Drew, Fred all trying to battle for position here. Yeah. We've got another one incoming now. Kitty. Oh, Fred with the fastest up with 117.3. Kitty with a huge handbrake off the end of the track in T1. Moved down into 7th, 8th, 9th. 10th. Kitty has just ended up at the back of the grid for that one, so the sabotage has worked. Um, livery was won by Drew first sub was Kitty Drew now got a half second uh, pen but is moved nice into the lead here point eight into the lead then we've got Fred, Romeo, the fluff Naterade, Matt, Nevy, Mrs. Romeo Demo and Kitty 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 who's battling back for some position oh honestly Vemon, you don't have to be scared of joining CTT. So Mrs. Romeo, who's in these races, joined us with zero race experience and zero interest in cars and is now second in the championship overall. Now, I'm not expecting you to come and join and be second in the championship overall, but what we did for her first season, where she didn't, she wasn't second in the championship overall the first season, we left her. She figured things out. I didn't give her loads of screen time. I didn't embarrass her. Same with Nevy. They didn't want to do the reverse things that we had, so I would leave them. So you don't don't feel like I'm gonna come out here and embarrass you because that's not what it's about. Drew, ooh. fifth gear only, please. Fifth. Half second penalty still to serve. Fred and Romeo with a one second as well. Romeo, what have you been doing? Fluff day trade with a half second as well. Everyone needs to stop cutting corners here. Kitty has claws, wall rind off nearly in front of Nevy. Nevy's held on for dear life there. Got a penalty as well. Guys, you all need to be a bit more sensible. Kitty is in the grass. Kitty into the back of Mrs. Romeo. Kitty's everywhere. What's going on, Kitty? That was wild driving. That was aggressive. 
I mean, I can leave you at the back and not put the camera on you once if you want to join. The best way to practice these sorts of races is just get on and do it. If you don't want any airtime, I won't give you any airtime. It's simple as that. But don't feel scared to join TTT. It's a really lovely community of people and it's uh, there's nothing to be scared of. Not from me or not from anyone who drives. That was a feral kitty, right? Rabies, yeah. Fred is the race leader. Romeo is up in second and Matt is in third. Fred is the person I predicted would win this race. Not that I know anything, I'm just saying. <laughs> That's who I'm putting my money on, but Fred's about to get saboed, so let's see. Spinning the wheels. Oh no, why did I put my money on you? Oh no, it might just slip into the- Yes, queen! Brad. Handbrake only, please. Brad, handbrake only, we'll keep all eyes on Fred. Yeah, 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 absolutely. I'll leave you absolutely alone until you're ready to be on camera. All eyes on Fred. All eyes on Fred. All eyes on Fred. He's got a three and a half second lead and he's only got a handbrake to use. How's it going to go? Engine braking. Clever. Will you do it for T1 though? Let's see. Romeo, Matt behind with the two second. Drew's in fourth. Naterade's in fifth. Here comes Fred's handbrake turn into T1. I'm impressed. Frederick, Flintstones, meet the Flintstones. I'm well impressed, Fred. Romeo's looking to gain position, though. Yeah, I'm well impressed. One minute left. Get your biddies out. Get your biddies out. Get your biddies out. Get your biddies out. Thank you so much for the 10 biddies, Jenko. A tig old biddies. Fred! Fred's going for the scenic route into first place. Romeo gonna go round the outside, round the outside. When Romeo goes flying round the outside, round the outside. Ooh! We have another one! All eyes on Drew. He just bunny hopped for no reason again. Let's spin the spin the wheel. Romeo. Inters, please. The Inters love Romeo today. We bunny hop in this bitch. We do. We've had two cars already bunny hot. We're only eight minutes into the race. 31 minutes to go. Drew and Kitty, one second and a half second. Nadere chasing in behind. Fred is in fifth. One second pen as well. What's with all the pens? Half second pens in Nevi. Damo, thank you for being a clean driver. Matt's in the pits. Mrs. Romy is in the pits. Both exiting now. Not Easter yet, boys and girls. Yeah, absolutely. Absolutely, Bemin. Got 31 minutes to go. We got 31 minutes to go. If you like me and you know, it's studio. You got 21 seconds before. You gotta go and you hear me in the studio. Oh no, you hear me in the studio. Oh no, if you like me and you know, it's studio. We got 21 seconds before. You gotta go. Sorry. 21 seconds. Ah, ah, ah. <laughs> Couldn't resist the end bit. <clears throat> I never disappoint. I never disappoint. My repertoire of songs is there. <laughs> Drew. Oh, Romeo's decided to pit now. Tires aren't too shot for Rome. Is it, it's not a fuel thing. Interesting decision to pit there for Rome. Drew's in first, Nato in second, Fred in third. I think that's my favourite bit of it. The 21 seconds. Ah, ah, ah. <laughs> okay, it's going to be Drew Sabo unless he does something absolutely horrific. Oh yeah, Rome had to pit for inters. Uh -huh. Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh dear. 
No, he's just he's just avoided hell. Drew Loser place. Come on, speedy Drusales. Janko is complete. Oh, he's lost two places. Oh my god, we want to replay Fred, and I don't know where Fred is. I don't know what's going on. Here's Fred, here's Fred. We want to replay Fred. What did Fred do? Have we had another bunny hop? Oh! <laughs> he bunny hops into the pit. <laughs> Later, Aid has taken a three second lead here. We've had three bunny hops in the first 10 minutes. Drew, Damo, Fred, Romeo, Kitty, Nevi, Matt, and Mrs. Romeo rounding up the back at the moment. Booty hops. Then booty hops, booty hops, booty, booty, booty hops. Nine seconds is the gap between the podium and fourth. So they are pulling away here, this little pack. Naderade is in the lead. Naderade won two races back to back in the uh, in the last TTT. So we'll look to try and get back to winning Rays. Bluff and Drew side by side. Drew with the inside line. Bluff's having a bit and has just gone into the wall. Three second penalty picked up. Okay, here comes the spinning wheel of doom. It's going to be Naderade's. Unless Naderade does something horribly wrong. Oh, I like it. I like it, I like it. I like it like that. Naderade. Instant three... Oh, no! Drew! <laughs> Instant 360. <laughs> Oh god, it's all gods. That was crazy. That was like literally on the 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 second. It, oh my god, Adrian now goes nine seconds into the lead. That was so close. Look at look at the time. Oh, it's, it'll be too late past that. We'll catch the three sixty again though. God Almighty, Drew. Drew's just keeping me on my toes there. One minute until the next sabotage. Oh my god, there's eight seconds between the top three, top four. And then, literally, there's eight seconds between everyone. What is going on? Fred is at the back here. One minute behind. One and a half second penalty picked up as well. Fred, I voted you as my winner. Will you hurry up? No, he's not nailing in the 360s today, is he? He's really not. He's going to hope to redeem himself though, because I remember the last time he did this where he had a couple of fluffed up uh, 360s, he then did like the most insane one. So he's going to be hoping that another one comes up now. 10.7 seconds is the lead for Naderade. Matt, who's not feeling very well, in fifth with Nevi chasing him behind. Mrs. Romy has moved up to seventh from the back, making progress at least. Then we've got... Romeo and the Fluff. Romeo's picked up four seconds worth of penalties. The Fluff's picked up 1.5. We've got another Wheel of Doom coming in. It's going to be Drew. What do we got for you, Drew? Ooh, he just missed it. He just missed the reverse. Drew. Hard tyres, please. To be fair, yeah, he did. He absolutely nailed the 1080. It was like an Ollie fakey 1080 dazzling thing. I've never seen anything like it. That will be clipped. That will definitely be TikTok footage. Demo. Kitty has claws, Matt, Nevi, Mrs. Romeo, Naderade, Fred, Fluff, and Romeo. That makes me remember, if you don't already follow my TikTok, follow me on TikTok. It's Tiny Turner. All the little funny bits go on there. And my own driving as well. So, if you don't follow me on TikTok, go follow me on TikTok. Now. Or I'll sabotage the shit out of you. Nevi being chased down by Mrs. Romeo and Naderade. Hey, broski. Let's see a dub. 
I see a dub. I want to see a dub. Drew's just had to go into the pits for racing hard. Damo's just moved into lead with 0.5 second penalty. Kitty's gone into second. Also back. Let's go. Let's go. Everyone's back. Did you get to the shops together? Oh, okay. Robbie, 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 Robbie. What's your meal deal? What's your meal deal? This is where I just I determine whether we can be friends or not. Oh, Krispy Kremes. I love a Krispy Kreme. I'm pretty boring with donuts. I only like chocolate or jam. I don't like flavors. Like like funky ones. Na 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 nine. Romeo, Nevi, Fred. We've got another Wheel of Doom coming. It's going to be kitty, 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 kitty. Hey, kitty, 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 kitty. You whack. Oh, is it going to just slip into it? It is. Kitty, kitty, kitty. Reverse for two minutes, please. Around kitty goes. Oh, struggling to get the car around. Unfollow his channel. <laughs> no, I don't like custard donuts. I don't like custard, like pastry stuff, really. Not really. It's weird because I love things like creme brulees and things like that, but I don't like custard pastries. Krispy Kremes, thank you so much for that follow. Thank you so much for that follow. Krispy Kremes are extortion. Mm, are they though? I see them as an investment to my ever-growing hips. These hips don't lie, honey, and it's all because of the Krispies. The Krispy Kremes. Do you know what one of my favourite uh, donuts is, though, aside from Krispy Kreme? And you're all going to laugh at me first, but I genuinely really love them. Uh, what? Who am I replaying? Who? Replay fluff. Sorry, guys, I have to be quick. Oh! 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 He's all right. He held it. He did very well to hold that as long as he did. Um, Greg's, Greg's jam donuts. Sorry, but not sorry. I could eat ten and not feel guilty for that. Remy is slowing down here. Matt is moving very much into the lead. I am getting a return on my investment. Just a layer of fat on my hips and my ass. Downing a copper in a pit stop, not advisory. <laughs> oh, I could, I could easily eat ten. Ma, in five seconds, only second gear for the next two minutes. Now, I could, I could eat ten. I could easily eat ten. I, I I'll do it on stream. Oh, Romeo's in the wall. What's happened there? How did that happen between those two? Let's replay. Here comes Romeo flying into T1. Round nicely. Oh, Romeo didn't remember that Matt was in second gear only and thought he was going to match pace, but he didn't. Unlucky. Oh, J Greg's jam donuts is so good. Can he eat donuts without licking lips, though? I've never tried, actually. I've never tried. Should I try it on stream? Should I go buy myself a, a Greg's jam donut and try it on my next stream? I might give it a go, you know. Drew is in the lead. Fred and then the fluff up in third right now. <laughs> I bet I can't do it. Do I have to eat the, the whole donut? Do I have to eat the whole donut? That would be so funny. I'll give it a go. I'll do it on my next stream. I'll get the donut and um, I'll give it a go. We've got 20 seconds until the next wheel spin. I've got to eat the whole thing. <laughs> Please choke. <laughs> ah! Ah! I don't want to choke. Apart from on your dad's dick. Idiot. Right, Drew. <laughs> Drew, only fifth key. Drew, only fifth key.
imagine trying to troll me? Can you imagine trying to troll me? <laughs> Can you imagine turning up to my stream and trolling me? Lol. <coughs> oh shit. And reset. Back to nice tiny. So we've got Drew in the lead here. Fluff is in second. Sir Fluffington the third. And then we've got Fred in there. Nate Raid in fourth. And Romeo in fifth. Battling after what was a big mistake into the back end of map. <laughs> Sorry guys. Sorry that was highly unprofessional. I just saw my chance and I took it. I, I just saw my chance and I took it. Oh, right, right, I'm reset. I've taken my time. <laughs> <laughs> he just got cooked. <laughs> oh shit, that's too funny. Oh, Jenko's like, what did I miss? Nothing, you're too young. <laughs> the fluff. Okay, here we go. Right, let's reset. No, reset now. It's back to seriousness here. Back to seriousness now. Drew is going to get the next Sabo. Ooh, it's nearly, is it going to be? It's on the line, but he just avoided it again. Drew. Lose a place. There we go. How long have we got left? We've got 17 minutes left. We're doing good. We're doing good. Fluff's moved into the lead here. Fred, Drew, Romeo and Naterade. That's your top five. Then we've got Mrs. Romeo in sixth. Nevi, Damo, Kitty and Matt right at the back. But there's only 48 seconds between first and last. So that is very much regainable. Daniel K with a gifted to that deck. Thank you so much, Daniel K. You're too sweet. You're too sweet. Are you not asleep yet? I thought you might be. That deck will be happy. That deck will be very, very grateful. I know he will be. Thank you so much for the gifted, honeys. Hey, kitty. Kitty. Are you texting whilst driving? It's highly not recommended. <laughs> Craig. Craig. The Fluff, Fred and Drew. They've got Romeo and Naderade. Legend, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome in. How are you doing today, Legend? Okay, come on, Fluffy, what have we got for you? Five tenths in front. Drew and Romeo. Romeo looking to try and take third here. Has gone fast into T1 there. Has taken third here. Good, thank you. Where are you from, Legend? Me? Ha, ah, sleep, don't be silly. It's only 10 minutes. Oh, it's only 10 minutes to 9. Okay, it's not too late. It's not too late. What time do you normally go to bed, folks? I'm, I'm, a, I'm a definite night owl. I'm a definite, like, anything earlier than 11 o'clock and it's only because I've passed out rather than, uh, like, actually gone to sleep. I'm definitely everything post uh, 11 o'clock. You're from Germany. Welcome in. We've got loads of Germans that join us in here, so welcome in. Thank you so much for the follow. Hey, Fred, instant 360, please. <clears throat> Always oh, messed up the 360. Am I going to allow it? Am I going to allow it? I'll allow it. Daniel K with another gifted. And this time it's gone to brow. Kitty has claws. If I go before 11pm, it's because I'm sick. Yeah, yeah, same mum. Either I've stayed up too late the night before or I'm not well. Yeah, yeah. Usually around 11 p.m. I'll be in bed asleep by about 12. Yeah, I'm like 12 1. I think I'm asleep. Roses are red. TTT is bliss. In case you're wondering, new name. Who this? I know who is this. Who this? Seb. Seb who? Seb Kavalki? Uh, you look like a bit of a badger, though. Has anyone ever told you that? I saw you on YouTube with the big crash. On Rutex, yeah, when I hit the pit wall. When I hit the pit wall and that guy like pushed me into the pit wall. You've heard it many times. You also look German. Where are you from? Seb. New followers. 
You sub on YouTube. Thank you so much. Thank you so much for all the people and the love on Team Red. And the love on Team Purple, guys. <clears throat> Just all the love. All the love. Sending nothing but the power positivity tonight. Nothing but good vibes. Sending. We have been in good vibes all night, baby. Nothing is going to stop this train. Yeah, sure. You're also German. Oh. So you look like a badger and you're German. I think you could have made your name a little bit better than Seb. Let's get the wheel of doom spinning. Maybe like bad German and then it sounds like badger and German. I think that would have been more clever. It's going to be Drew. Drew! <laughs> Drop to the back, please. <clears throat> you forgot to sub on YouTube? Oh, thanks guys for the subs on YouTube. I'm trying to grow it over there at the moment. If you ever got some spare time, throw one of my longer videos up and just leave it running. <laughs> I'm trying to get those watch hours up, babies. Seb the German Badger. That would have been a better name as well. How have you been, Badger Man? And oh, sorry, Seb. Sorry. How have you been, Seb? Oh, that can I just call you Badger Man? Thank you so much. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. I appreciate all the love over there. Damo, Mrs. Romeo, Matt, and Romeo. That is your top five. Naterade and the fluffer in the pits. I'm going to be spinning the wheel in a minute. Okay, I'm going to continue to call you Badgerman because I just that's just what I've always called you and I want to, to continue to do so. <laughs> I'll call you what you want, but I prefer to call you Badgerman. Um, wh what have you been up to? Tell me. You've always got something interesting going on. I, uh, <clears throat> I didn't drive in this league. I run this league. Um, I then just do my own little thing on the days where I don't run this. So this is Thursday and tomorrow night. And then on like a Monday and a Wednesday, I do my own driving streams. So if you see me on a Monday, Wednesday, it'll be me driving. If you see me on a Thursday day and a Friday night, it'll be these this league that I host. But it's only one Friday night a month, which happens to be tomorrow. And then there won't be another Friday night for a little while. So I might be driving. It depends. Happy belated birthday. Happy belated birthday. 31st. Oh my God, I'm older than you. That's so depressing. I'm older than you. Okay, we've got Fred here. What can we do with the drunken sailor? Okay, Fred. Box, box, mediums. Please, guys, if you haven't already watched, please watch the Turn It Vlogs. Thank you so much, Daniel K. Yeah, I've not got one coming out for another week yet. Um, and I'm hoping to take you guys with me to the FA Cup semi-final. Um, I'm going to take you to a few other things I've got going on as well, so that should be fun. You decided to rebrand to my real name and look more professional since I want to pursue a career in motorsports engineering. Do you know what? I understand it. It makes sense. You say you might be older than me, but you look at least five years younger than me. I wish. I bloody wish. It's all thanks to the Botox on his. <laughs> How old am I? I'm 31. I turned 31 on March the 10th. So I'm only 11 days older. But I am older. But yes, I am 31. It's all the Botox, guys. That's why I'm looking so fresh. <laughs> Wish. Actually, please don't have Botox. <laughs> You're a little bit late. I am 31. I'm good, Blindy. How are you? Romeo has moved into the lead here with Natoray chasing on the fluff. I've only had a little bit of paper. A uh, paper? What am I talking about? Paper? You're talking about paper rounds. A little bit of Botox in between my eyebrows. So you know that 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 thing. I can't do that very well anymore. But that's it. Thank you so much, Wolf. Botox isn't plastic. Botox isn't surgery. It is a muscle relaxing injection that stops your fine lines and wrinkles. It is not plastic. I have not got fillers. I've not had anything injected into my face to plump things up. It is just a little muscle relaxant. I look like 24. You need to have me, Kirklander. You need to have me on PSN. It's Tiny Turn at 13. It's a friends only lobby. Romeo, Romeo instant 360, please. 
Oh, Romeo's Insta360 has ended him up in the wall with a 1.5 penalty. What's he doing? Well, you could. You might enjoy it. You need to have me on PSN Tiny Turn at 13 and then you'll be able to find the lobby. The next race we are into Largos in the Lexus RCF GT500 Group 2. So once this race is finished, you can come on in. Oh, Jesus. Naderade five seconds in the lead now. The fluff's gone round. Kid, he has claws with the one second penalty. Playing catch up to the leader, if possible. Kitty also with the fastest lap with a 110. Been really fast all day today. Fred is in fourth. Nevy's in fifth. Romeo's in sixth. Then we've got Damo, Mrs. Romeo, Matt, and Drew, who's right at the back. 49 seconds to catch up. But fresh tyres and plenty of fuel, so we'll see how he goes. He's at the back, but fresh tyres, lots of fuel and the rest of the race to catch up. Not the end of the world, he could definitely be in there by the end. You can't find me on PSN, tiny turn at 13, no? Hey Adam, I'm good, how are you? Welcome in. Okay, let's spin this wheel. On Naderade. Okay, if you want to put your name in the chat, I'll add you after this race, Legend. Oh dear. No, you don't, Jenko. I've checked my settings. It's not. You definitely don't. I've checked it now. Because everyone kept saying the same thing, but it's not. My settings are absolutely fine. Naderade, reverse for two minutes, please. Round Naderade goes. Naderade has got to reverse for two full minutes. What's your name, Legend? What's your PSN? Yes, we are doing another race. We are going on to Interlagos in the Lexus. We've got a replay on Fluff here requested. Completely lost it on turn one. Into Damo, into Nevi. Oh my goodness. Damo's then ended up going around. Recovered. The floor. Oh, that was not good. RCR Legend or Jan Doma. Okay. I'll add you after this race. Hey, Morgan. How are you doing? Are you coming to join us for the last race, Morgan? Carnage. We've got... um. Sabotage is every one minute from 34 minutes. Remember that, guys. Kitty has claws going in for a pit stop. Five seconds in the lead. Fred will take the lead here. Romeo is going to take second. Mrs. Romeo is going to take third. Nevy is going to take fourth. And Damien will take fifth. Carnage. 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 Why are we saying carnage in as many ways as possible? So Fred, who was the person I said was going to win the race, is now five seconds in the lead. But... We've got a hell of a lot of sabos coming in now. Yeah, yeah, no worries, Morgan. Come in and hang out in the chat. No problem. By the way, anyone watching who wants to come into the party chat, you're more than welcome um, to, to listen to what I have to listen to during the race. It's very interesting. <clears throat> okay, here we go. What's going to be the first of the minute penalties? It's going to Fred and it's awful. Oh, Fred. Fred, reverse for one minute, please. At least it's one minute now and not two. Mrs. Romeo's going to take the lead. Next sabotage in one minute. Here's Fred going the wrong way down the straight here. <clears throat> it's the Lexus RCF GT500 Group 2 one. You can hear Romeo from here. God, Mum, I'm so sorry. You have to hear all sides of this, don't you? Instant Sabo on Drew from Jenko. Ooh, racing mediums, please. And we're going to spin the wheel again on Mrs. Romeo now. Mrs. Romeo, handbrake only for the next minute, please. Wow, loser of sabotage is going out. We've got a replay, Fred. 
Red's in, Fred's in reverse here. What's the replay for? What's he do? Does he mess up his 180? Oh my god, he nearly went into the pits. He nearly reversed his way back into the pits. So Mrs. Romeo, handbrake only. She's getting chased down by Matt. So Drew is in third, got to pit for mediums once he gets round in a second. Mrs. Romeo's got handbrake only and we've got another Wheel of Doom spin incoming. It will... Oh no, Mrs. Romeo's lost it into the gravel. He's lost it into the gravel. Matt. Matt. Handbrake only. Apologies, I miss most of the race. My fat cat is now laying on my foot. No, don't worry, don't worry, Daniel, don't worry. I just appreciate you being here and lurking and anything. All the love just supports the channel. It means everything to me, guys. Fluff is in second, Kitty is in third, Romeo is in fourth, and Damo is in fifth. Drew never in the pits. Drew in the pits because he got an instant sabo from his friend Jenko, who's trying to slow down his lead at the front. He's got to put on medium. It's not the worst compound he could have got, but, you know, it's still going to slow him down considerably for the rest of this race. Three sabotages at least left to go. Matt's already on handbrake only. We're checking that. He's doing well. Oh, he's taking the scenic route. He's taking the scenic route. And he's very well held, Matt, actually. Very, very, very well held. Matt, you need to pit for racing hard tyres next, please. Thank you so much. Yeah, like, like honestly, just having the stream up. Legend! Thank you so much for the tier one sub. Let's go, legend. Let's go, legend. Thank you so much for that sub, honey. I appreciate you being here and I appreciate that sub. Let's get that sub. Thank you so much. Fluff has moved in to first. Kitty has close in second, Demo in third. There's not much between first and second, look. But Demo's got four seconds to find to try and impact this race. The Wheel of Doom's going to spin again any second now. Legend, thank you so much for that sub. I appreciate you. <laughs> You're so funny. Let's spin this wheel for floof. Oh my goodness, Sir Fluffington the third drop to the back. Drop to the back. Wow. Oh, wow. He's got to drop to the back. That is savage. I mean, if the office jockey asks, I'm working, definitely working, definitely working, Blindy. As long as you don't get in trouble on my behalf. As long as you don't get in trouble. My nose is itchy. Why does my nose always itch when I'm on stream? Okay. Kitty, Damo, Mrs. Romeo's in a good position here. Kitty and Damo need to be slowed down considerably, though. Let's get the Wheel of Doom up again. Okay, what's Kitty going to get? Okay, Kitty's got a nice one. Kitty's got a really nice one here, providing she does it well. Kitty, instant 360, please. Nice. Nice. Oh, Damo's gone into the back of Kitty there. Didn't see the 360 taking place. Jesus. Mrs. Romeo looking to try and take second. Are we going to have time for one more sabotage? I think we will. It will just be one more though, not two more. It's going to be Kitty. I think. Okay, this might be interesting how this race is going to finish now. I think the race is going to, it's going to be on the line. I don't think it's going to make a difference. Kitty, fifth gear only, please. Oh, is Kitty going to hold it? Kitty should hold it. Damo's going to close the gap though, at least. 
It is a kitty win. It is Damo's second. Mrs. Romeo on the podium here. Fred's going to take fourth. Drew fifth. Natorade sixth. Matt seventh. Romeo eighth. Fluffy ninth. And Nevi tenth. Thank you so much for the follow. Mr. Cam Cam. What a name. I love that. Can. Can you do the Cam Cam? Can you do the Cam Cam? Sorry, not sorry, Drew. Where did Drew end up? Where did Drew end up? Fifth. You could have done with a better Sabo coming up, to be honest with you, but... Okay, let me do the points first. Oh, we're not doing the points. We've got a TIA, guys. We've got a TIA. Adam Hamilton, I've got your friend request there. Okay. We're doing a TIA. Who's the TIA between? Nevi and Damo. Okay, let's have a look. So th what a TIA is, it's an investigation into an incident that's happened where someone thinks their racist outcome has been affected by what happened on track. So let's see. Okay, it's, it's, it's a grainy footage here. We want lap 26 between... Nevi and Matt. Oh, Nevi and Demo, sorry. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. that's quite clear cut. Yeah. Same is too late on the break. It's obvious. It's I don't think I don't think he'd have made it whether you're in front of him or not. Yeah, yeah. Okay. So Nevi was in second there. Where does Nevi finish the race? Oh shit. Where does Damo finish the race? Damo says we both carry on from the same point. I'm going to go out on limb here and say that. I think it, it, it's obvious Damo just breaks late, which is fine, but it's how we then settle it. Oh my goodness, Legend with a gifted to Dom Pebbles! Legend, you're being too kind, honey. Thank you so much for all the love. That's crazy. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay. Um, can we have input from Romeo and Drew, my TIA officials, as to where I, how I settle that? Because I have no idea how to settle that. We're going to just see. Watch on. I followed. The demo says watch on. I followed and stayed behind till he got the penalty. And I sneezed so I broke late. <laughs> That's fine demo. It's not a witch hunt. Don't worry. Uh, it's the Lexus RCF GT500, the next one. If you stay behind him, I think we just have to... What's just happened? Oh my goodness! Legend with the five gifted now? What is 
happening and we got a level 2 hydrate choo choo legend what is going on buddy thank you so much oh my goodness hey, right. I'm so sorry you want I'm blue it's already blue it's already blue Okay, are we saying no further action? No further action. No further action. Demo waits for plenty of time to let Nevi catch up. No further action. Okay, we are going back to Interlagos, my friends. You need to get yourself the Lexus RCF GT500. It's the group two. We're going to have a little break so I can just have a bathroom break and then we'll be right back to it. You want to see red? I see red. Red. Good morning, G90 Bomber. Welcome in. How are you doing today? How are you doing today? I need to go for a quick... You want some dancey dance? You want some dancey dance? I'm really good. Thank you so much for asking. That's my biggest problem in the stream. I end up drinking like three liters of water plus a brew. I need to eat so much. Yeah, that's, that's what's happening right now, Blindy. That's what's happening. March into her own tree. That's what I do. That's what I do. There's no music in here. I'm just like a bopping. Do you not ever just find yourself bopping? I feel like my brain just plays music all the time though. I didn't forget you on PSN. I've not given out the points of the last race yet. <laughs> I haven't forgotten you yet, legend. One minute, honey. I've just realized I'm not giving out the points yet. So we've got 15 points going to Kitty. 14 points going to Demo. 13 points going to Mrs. Romeo. 12 points going to Fred. 11 points going to Drew. 10 points going to Naterade. Where's Naterade? There's Naterade. 10 points. 9 points going to Matt. 8 points going to Romeo. 7 points going to Floof. 6 points to Nevi. Yeah, poll kitty is already done. Who won the races? So so far, Fred has Fred has won one, and Kitty has won one. Okay, let me nip for a quick quick bathroom break. Add Legend on PSN, and we're going to get the next race underway. So go take a break now, guys, and be right back in five minutes. Okay, Legend, if you can hear me, I know I'm on the screen. I can't, um, 
Brilliant. I can't find you under RCR Legend or Jan Domex. I can't find you under either. So will you do me a favour, Legend, and add HRA underscore Romeo, who's one of the drivers from today, and then um, you should be able to either add me or just join through being a friend of a friend. Let me put this in here. Add, add this name, HRA underscore Romeo, and then you'll be able to, should be able to join. I'm just going to quick nip for a quick bathroom break and I'll be right back. What just happened? You got him? So you should be able to join then. You should be able to join. Have you seen baby packs? Oh my god, don't let my face. Don't let my face. Puppy! Oh! Punch. Poncho. Poncho, come. No, that's packs. Poncho. Poncho, come on. They want to see you too. Come in, bud. There we go, there we go. Doggos! They're both he's, they're both he's. Okay, we'll get the next race underway in two minutes, probably. So get in. Sorry, uh, well, I've got a whip here and a cocker spaniel. Doggy cameo. We love a little doggy cameo on this stream, eh? Right, let's get the thing. You found me now? Oh, I've got friends. Okay, let me just... I've got a few friend requests here. Okay, there we go. I've added all the friends that have added me. There's five in total, so welcome in newbies. Get yourself the car. Alexis RCF, GT500, group two, get into the lobby quick, 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 quick. So we've got some new blood in... Who have we got in here? We've got FRGT Adam in here, who's an A-plus straight driver. Let me add... Oh, hang on. Oh, actually, it's fine. We're going to add invite players. Yeah, we just got a couple of newbies coming in. RCR. Jenko with them tiggle biddies, get your biddies out. Get your biddies out. Why can't I find FR? Why can't I find GT Adam? GT Adam, what's your name on PlayStation? I can't see you on her. Unless you've got a funny name. Um, 
Adam Halson, oh there you are, got you. You can join in the party chat if you want, but if it's too noisy you don't have to, it's just easier for me to give out sabotage. <clears throat> Alright, Legend, are you coming on in? A wonky nipple? Who's got wonky nipples? Tig old biddies. Jenny's got wonky nipples. That is so funny. Are you coming in, Legend? Or are you were you adding me for for another day? Are you joining us, Legend? It's okay. Are you are you going to race? Legend, are you coming to join race? It needs to be the Lexus RCF GT500. It has to be that car. It has to be. I'll show you. This car. I'll write it in the chat for you now. That's the car it has to be. It can't be any other car. Okay. <clears throat> do, 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 do. Okay, I'll give it a couple of minutes and then we're going to have to get going because we're a little bit behind schedule now. Not because of legend, just because we've overrun a little bit. Just a little smidgy smidge. Uh, okay, Legend, maybe next time then. Uh, tomorrow night, the Daihatsu Copen, the Shelby GT350R, and Alpine. If you put exclamation point Discord in the chat, everything is in there. So you'll be able to see everything that you need for tomorrow. It's all written down. There you go. If you join there, you'll be able to. Good morning from Naderade's mom. Oh my gosh. Hi, Naderade's mom. How are you doing? Welcome in. He's doing really, really well. He won two races last week and he's been up amongst it all day today. Uh, no legend, it has to be the same car, I'm, I'm afraid, just because it's a whole series with prizes on the line. I can't have people in different cars. We'll have to do maybe tomorrow, if you can get the right cars. Daihatsu Copen, the Shelby and the Alpine, okay? Thank you, thank you, thank you. I'm sorry that I can't have you in, it's just because it's, it's difficult when it's a championship. Nate's mama. Need a raid. Need a raid, your mama's here. Can I write the cars in the chat? Yeah. If anyone has access to um Anyone has access to Discord, please could you type in tomorrow's tracks and cars for Legend? That would be really helpful. But in the meantime, we are going to judge the liveries for Brazil week. And we are in the Lexus right now. A 
Okay, Nevi. Shall we wait till a couple of laps go so it's not too hard or should we just do it? I think we'll just do it. Okay, so we've got Nevi here. We've got... Nevi with the Ayrton Senna, sorry, she just got wiped out by Romeo, actually held it very, very well. So we've got the Brazilian colours again, we've got Consul on the side as well. Some Ayrton Senna's face on there. Rest in peace, 30 years to, 30 years to his death and this is actually Ayrton Senna's birthday today. How amazing is that? Adam, as long as you can take it on the chin in terms of the sabotages and you don't expect to win every race, you'll be absolutely fine. Okay, so Fred now. So we've got... Is it... Hey? That was the same car, no? Nevi and Fred have got the same car, yeah? Oh, but Fred's not got the faces on it, so Nevi's just adjusted it a little bit. So this is the same car, but he's got Rogue on the front, Twisted Track Days, and no pictures of Ayrton Senna there. Then we've got Matt here with the Brazil flags, the president on there as well. Senna's the goat, yeah. His birthday today, that's crazy, isn't it? The Brazil uh, registration there as well. I'll just have to shut this door because the dogs are fighting. One minute. Oh my god, I nearly fell off the chair. I nearly fell off the chair. Okay, we're fine. Brazil colours. And then we've got Kitty, Kitty, Kitty. Kitty hasn't got the Brazil, which is fine, I think. Unless I'm missing something. So, Natorade has got the Brazilian colours. This is really nice and subtle from Natorade, actually. We've got the green and gold, or green and yellow, sorry down the side a turnip over the the front wheel arch the turnip logo on the front as well we've seen nevi's romeo here with the senna very very nice see senna on the top there we've got the marble car i love the marble car it's the replica of um Ayrton senna's 1999 and uh, 1993 car sorry so this is an exact replica of that. And he's got the uh, Senna on the side there. Romeo's daughter's birthday today, is Oh my goodness. Happy birthday to Romeo's daughter. I didn't know. Man of banana. Oh yeah. Sorry, honey. I didn't know. I would have waited for you. I would have waited for you. I didn't know. So this is a replica of Ayrton Senna's 1993 car. I do love the marble liveries. I always have throughout the whole of TTT. So Drew here has got the year one livery, which we always see. Um, but he slightly adjusted it to Ayrton Senna. So on the front here, you can see Instituto Ayrton Senna. So what that is, it is a charity that um, helps children in Brazil, basically. So that's awesome. Um, 30 years on, still going strong. We've got Felipe Massa on this side as well, as you can see at the bottom. His number was 19. Ayrton Senna was 12. So they've got, he's got the, both the numbers on there. So Ert and Drew's number actually when he races is 12. So he's got the same number as Ayrton Senna. I wonder if that's intentional or not. I don't know. Or whether he just likes the number 12. Damo's not come out the pitch yet. We've seen Fred. Mrs. Romeo here. Oh. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. And I actually wrote that down as well. <laughs> so, in Brazil, there is a beautiful staircase here. And I did write this down to remember. It's called the Escadaria Celeron. But I'm probably saying that wrong. And he's done that on the back window as well. I did just miss that. I thought I got every point. I thought I thought it's gonna be so proud of me. I got every point. No, no. <laughs> so there we go. I just missed that little point. So it's the Scudaria Celaron, 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 Celaron. This is where we can use the same D car used for Granny. Okay, what else have we got? Fred. Mrs. Romeo here in the Brazil. Now I like it. So we've got the turnip with the Brazil flag on the bottom bumper. 
Oh, I like this a lot. I like this a lot. It's got the World Cup on the front. Oh, I like this. The Fluff and GC Adam don't have liveries. So. Ooh. For me, it's actually between. Oh, God. It's between Romeo and Mrs. Romeo. Oh, God. Oh, Jesus. There's going to be a pole going up here. Okay, guys, make sure you pick the not the person you want to win, the person you think's got the best livery. The poll is up now, so I'm going to flick between the two so you can see. So, Mrs. Romeo's Brazil. And where's Romeo? Is he in fifth? Romeo's replica Ayrton Senna car. The 1993 Ayrton Senna car. To Romeo or Mrs. Romeo? Uh, Miss Ashley, it's not. It's 9pm UK time. I got the time wrong on the thing. But thank you. 9pm UK time. Night time race. So Mrs. Romeo and Romeo. We've got a replica and a Brazilian car. No, no, it's my fault, Miss Ashley. But just, just as I saw it. But thank you so much for doing that. That's really helped me out. Romeo... Mrs. Romeo, get your votes in quick, quick, quick. The time is going. Who's got the best car? Five points to Romeo. Five points there, so we'll get that put in. <clears throat> we don't have a prediction up, I don't think I need to do one. I'll restart it now. <clears throat> Who will win? There we go. Guys, get your predictions in. Who's going to win this race? Five min vote for predictions. No, I've done 15 minutes because the race is 40 minutes. That McLaren was a thing of beauty, yes. Let's get the normal screen back underway. So Fred at the moment has qualified fastest by one tenth. Matt in second and Naterade in third. Has anyone got anyone to say about that? GT Adam, our fresh meet in, has just gone into third place. GG's Adam, nice to have you in the stream. Fred's still fastest. Kitty is slowing down Fred's hot lap here. Ooh, no, it's all gone wrong for Fred. Fred's going to have to ho hope that um, his 126.9 is enough here because that would have slowed him down too much. Matt. And GT Adam, Naterade, Drew, Kitty, can anyone go faster here? Get your votes in, guys. Quick, quick, quick. You want to bet those channel points? You want to bet them? Oh, Drew's just gone purple and fastest, seven tenths faster. Drew's just gone ten, seven tenths faster, which has moved GT Adam out of the top three here. Matt, Fred, and Drew on the podium. Any race vehicle, be it car, bike, truck, looks cool in Marlboro Colours. Yeah, I love the Marlboro Colours. I love the Marlboro Colours. It's a nice car. Look at it. It is a really, really nice car. Drew says he's going to go faster again. So let's see. But he is going to run into traffic. 126.2 is what he needs to be. But he is going to run into traffic here. Can he go faster? Oh, GT Adam has just gone one tenth slower than Drew. Good effort, Adam, but just short. Drew says he's going to go faster here. Let's see. Hello, John Marine. Happy Thursday. Happy TTT day. How are you doing, sir? 
Drew's gone five tenths faster here. I hope no one gets in the way here. This is going to be quick as from Drew. It's going to be quick as. Drew's gone three tenths or four tenths faster, half a second faster than anyone on the grid right now. Adam's first ever quali with us in second. Fred has taken third. Then we've got Matt, Natare, Kitty, Romeo, Damo, Mrs. Romeo, Nevi, and the Floof. Yep, that's fine, but also we have a prediction up for this race, so make sure you get your points gambled. The floof, the floof is back. The floof is back. Quali has gone to Drew, so there's an extra point there to Drew as well, which I need to not forget. Haha, <laughs> Drew, I didn't. There we go. So the points at the moment... Sorry about that, kitty. Sorry about that, kitty. To be fair though, the grid order doesn't make too much difference to the race, so you should be fine. You could be a minute and a half behind on the race and still manage to win, so. 28 points to, to the, the points so far from today. 28 points to Romeo, 25 points to Mrs. Romeo, 32 points to Drew, 15 points to Nevi, 22 points to Matt, 27 points to Fred, 17 points to Natare, 20 points to Damo, 24 points to Kitty, and 18 points to the Floof. So the winner so far overall on the day is Drew, then Romeo, then Fred. You want some Samba? Welcome in Guatemala, how you doing? Ay 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 ay! <laughs> right, let's get the Wheel of Doom up boys and girls. The Wheel of Doom is ready to go. Work, 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 work. How long have we got left here? Oh, there we go, there we go. We're finally done. Let's get the race underway. Everybody ready? Are we going? Drew, Brad, Matt, Natorade, Kitty, Romeo, Mrs. Romeo, Nevi, Damo, and Floof. I didn't hear from Kitty, I don't think. Oh no, it wasn't Kitty. Matt, Matt, it was Matt, it was Matt. Okay. I suppose so, Damo. Damo, you're doing well today, honey. You're doing well, apart from sneezing on T1. <laughs> yeah, can anyone stop him? He's already running the day again. Okay, here we go. So we've got no instant sabos yet. Oh, you want some blue? You can have some blue, legend. Thank you so much. So it is lights out and away we go. Bing! Oh god, that was just perfectly timed. No worries, John Marine, thank you so much for swinging by. Drew is away. We've got a newbie fresh blood in here as well. Need negative points for the best livery, what do you mean? No, no negative points in here unless you do something naughty. Okay, so Drew, Matt and Kitty. Drew qualifying so much faster than everyone else in quali. Ah, uh, sorry about that, Jenko. Where did Damo start from the last quarter? I'm not sure. I'm not sure. Damo's been hindered back here, though. It'll be alright. We've got a sabotage in one minute anyway, and everything might change, as you know. Everyone's okay in here. Naderade with a little wiggle, but held it really, really well. The Fluff, Romeo, seventh and sixth. Then we've got Fred up in fifth. Naderade looking to play catch up here. Then we've got Nevi with a little wiggle as well. Mrs. Romeo and Damo has... Ooh, Damo's cutting the grass for us for free. 
Thank you so much. So Drew, Matt, who was that? The fluff's gone off. Let's see what happened. What happened to Floof? Floof just lost it. Floof just lost it. Just hit the curb and went round. There was nothing to it. Let's spin the wheel. The first wheel spin is incoming. Drew? Stop, stop. Ooh. Drew's right away. No one hit into him, luckily, but he did get in the way there. Matt, now the new race leader, Fred, second, Adam in third. Matt's livery is looking pretty good as well. I just think it was a bit too busy. That's the only reason. If he'd have kept the gold and he'd have kept the... Let me show you what I mean for Matt's livery here. If he'd have kept the gold and the flag sort of being blended through and cut off a few of the extra, the little extra stickers, I think that could have been a winner. It was just too busy on the side. So we've got a minute till the next sabotage. Fred and Adam, first, second, and third. Romeo, Naterade, Drew, Romeo, Kitty, Nevi, Floof. Demo here. All right, all right. Let's just uh, let's try and keep spirits high, guys. Matt, Fred, and GT Adam. Adam has a Brazil livery. He has a Red Bull livery. Max V's girlfriend is from Brazil. Good. Good connection. Word association. Got the Wheel of Doom coming in quick. So you mean I'm not going to marry Max Verstappen? That's really unfortunate. He'd love me. I'm the shit house he needs in his life. Here we go. It's going to be for Matt. And it's not a bad one, really, in the grand scheme of it. Hey, Rohit, how are you doing? This car is the Lexus RCF GT500. It's the Group 2. And we're at Interlagos for Brazil Brazil Week. Brazil. Brazil. Lose a place, please, Matt. So he's down in second. We have our newbie Adam in two first. He's an A-rated driver, so he should be quite quick. He qualified second. Matt just nipped into first again. How did Adam just lose that place? How did Adam just lose that place? He was in first. Okay, deal. I feel like I am the shit house that he needs in his life. Whoops. Was that an Adam? Thing or was that a Matt thing? Let's see. Let's see it back. So this is T1. We're just replaying it here. I can't see. Oh, Romeo with a little bump there. Okay. No big, big, big deal here. Adam, it's going to be yours at this rate. Best things about Brazil. Senate into Lagos, Carnival, footy and the vibes. Yeah pretty much and the women walking around because the women the Brazilian women are like Mwah. Adam Fred and Naderade let's spin the wheel Okay, this is what it's going to be for Adam. I'm going to have to give it out at 10 seconds because Adam needs time to be able to do it. Adam, you need to box for wet tyres. Please change for wet tyres. Miss the pet entrance because it's not got through to him quick enough, so you'll have to go around again. And box for wet tyres, please, on your next time to the pit. Brazilian women are lit. Yeah, for sure, for sure, for sure. So Fred and Naterade here, Drew, Mrs. Romeo, Matt, Kitty, The Fluff, 
Nevi and Demo here. Romeo, how have we fallen back down to 11th right now? Oh, actually, there's only 13 seconds between first and last. Yeah, Adam has to pit for wet tyres, but missed the pit entrance by the time the sub was given. Right, um, Adam has opened up a massive gap here. Three and a half seconds is big. Good driver. Very nicely done around that corner. Fred following in behind. Nata Raid is in third. We will have to pit here for wet tyres. Hey, Sequema, how you doing? It is a gorgeous car, this one. I like this car. It's one of my favourites that we've picked out for the series. Fred will look to take the lead here whilst Adam has to go into the pits. Off he goes. Fred now in the lead. Naterade's in second. How are you doing? How's everybody doing? Who's just popped in? We've got a few new faces just jumped in. We've got the next Sabo coming in, guys. We're spinning that wheel. You heck. Welcome in, Adam. Welcome to the house of fun. Fred, you need to drop a place, please. Lose one place. Okay, Adam has now joined the party chat, so we'll be able to hear the sabotages instantly. Natorade moves into first. Drew and Fred second and third. Adam, in case you were wondering, we don't have a child driving. They're just in someone's microphone. <laughs> the Fluff, Matt, Levy, Mrs. Romeo, Adam and Rome. Yeah, I added you. Lemon, I did add you. Okay, one minute till the next up. Right, guys, let's just try and keep the party chat a little bit clear. Drew, Fred, and Kitty. Naderade leading the way. It was Mama Naderade still there? I don't know if Mama Naderade's still there, but your boy's doing good. Drew looking to try and win this race once again. Don't forget, if you've got 10k channel points, you can sabotage anyone at any point in the race. Where did Matt end up? Eighth. So Matt's in the pits in eighth. Then we've got Adam here with wet tyres. One second penalty picked up. The next wheel's going to spin. What do we? What are we hoping for, for Naterade here? Oh no, Drew. Going to be Drew. Oh. Right, Drew, Drew has got chance to redeem himself if he can hold on to the lead. Let's see. Everyone needs to watch the language while we've got a kid in the chat. Drew's got a chance to redeem himself. Yes, I do have Instagram row hit. It's Tiny Turnip. Drew, you need to do an instant 360, please. Oh. They've not been the sexiest from Drew today, but that one was much better than the last one. Fred in first now. Nathroy chasing it behind. Yeah, my Instagram is tinyturnip13, I think it is. You'll see my logo on there, but yeah, you can add me on there, no problem. Drew, Kitty, Demo, Mrs. Romeo up in sixth at the moment. GT Adam, who got wet tyres, is now slowing down. Adam, just so you know that the sabotages only last for two minutes, so if you wanted to change your tyres, you can after you've done it for two minutes. Need a raid! We've got a whole minute till the next sabo. Shall I remove the Wheel of Doom so you can see what's going on? Root kitty. Kitty, 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 kitty. Demo, Mrs. Romeo, and Matt. Adam has decided to get rid of the wet tyres, gone back onto racing softs. So it's got 18 seconds to catch up. 
Nevi, Romeo and Fluff. But look at this in the bottom left of your screen. We've got the fastest laps gone to Mrs. Romeo here. The 124.6. Mrs. Romeo is going fast. We have got boost on weak, but she still had to set it. Naderade number one. Friend number two. Drew number three with the Wheel of Doom coming in now. It's going to be Naderade. Hey, welcome back, Mystic. Okay, what have we got here? It's going to be another one of these. Naderade. Lose a place, please. Oh, that counts. It counts. It counts, yeah. You went down to second up to first. It counts. This is Romeo with the speedy speedy. The speedy speedy. Who's your money on now, folks? Who's your money on now? Who's going to win this race? Let's see how the prediction's looking. So the prediction, we had two people on Drew, one person on Nate, two people on Fred, one Damo, one Matt, and one other. So pretty much everyone's been covered off here. Canadian Candy, you're still here. Naderade is doing good. He's in second. He just got saboed. Drew will get the next one, so he's doing really, really well. He may, may go on and win it, but there's a long way to go. Half an hour le left to go. Let's see, let's see. Have we got any battles here? Mrs. Romeo's picked up a half second cutting pen there with Damo in behind and we've got Fred and Adam. Adam's still playing catch up from his wet tyres. Has definitely got the pace on Fred though right now. Not giving any room, looking for a mistake, looking for any sort of window to go through. This is the third race. Yep, last race of the day. Oh, don't worry about it, Mama. It's, I mean, some of the language may not be child friendly, but we're all child friendly people, so it's not like that. I'll try and tell them to keep the language at bay as well, because, you know. But no, don't worry about him. He's so cute. So, so cute. Here is Drew Sabotage. Let's spin the wheel of doom. Nader Raid and Kitty has claws have gone into the pits. Okay, Drew. Inters, please. Some act like children in the group chat. That's true, Dak Dak. What are you up to today, Dak Dak? Have you got anything nice planned? Mrs. Romeo up in second will look to take the lead. Drew is 16 seconds in, the, in front, but has to pit now. So Mrs. Romeo should regain the lead. Damo looking to say something about that as well. Honestly, everyone with kids who have your kids in the microphone, Miss Ashley and Naderade's mom. We we love kids. We love kids. There is no issue whatsoever. Don't worry about it. Don't ever feel stressed about it. It is what it is. They have a, a law they are a law into their own. They decide what they want to do and I'm not gonna be bothered about it, so you shouldn't be bothered about it. We've got one more minute till the next sabotage. Mrs. Romeo here. That duck is very polite, but he 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 gets frustrated at times. But he's always polite. But you'll you'll hear very often for F sake. <laughs> Drew's in the pits. Here comes Mrs. Romeo. We need a song for Mrs. Romeo because I don't want to give her a Romeo song. Cause they're Romeo songs. Demo's in second. <laughs> Miss Ashley. Oh my god. Yeah, Dad likes very polite other than he gets frustrated. And when he gets frustrated, well, we all do it. Fair enough, Dad, Dad. Fair enough. My day's been really good. It's TTT day, baby, so I'm happy. Okay, it's not the end of the world for Mrs. Romeo, but it is in some ways. It's not the worst that she could get, but it's not definitely not the best. Mrs. Romeo, please, can you go down to second gear and stay there for two minutes? Second gear only. So Mrs. Romeo will get slowed down by second gear only. We'll start losing fuel for that as well, because she'll be revving out. 
Damo's in second, GT Adam in third, Naderade and Fred. GTT all day, baby. We've got, what, 20 minutes left? And a little, so we've got about half, half an hour left of the stream. We should be done by half two today, which is about right. Mrs. Romeo's just gone wide there. Damo's taking the lead. GT Adam right behind, right behind. GT Adam just slips into front, actually. So we'll have another sabotage in one minute. And as it stands, it's going to be GT Adam who's worked his way up, went in for wet tyres, changed back to racing softs, and is back in the lead here. Fuel's looking a little bit low, so we'll need to pit within the next few laps at least. Debo, Naderade, Fred, Kitty has clauses in fifth, and we've got Matt, Mrs. Romeo, and Drew both decided to pit. You're not sure who you want to see to win because you did not see qualifying? Well, you just have to see who you think would win based on all the races you've seen previously. Drew was the fastest at quali by five tenths. Naderade and Damo. Then we've got Fred and Kitty. We've got 10 seconds till the next wheel spin. It's going to be Adam. Here comes the wheel spin. You want to see GT Adam? Well, let's see if we can sabotage him. Okay, GT Adam, you can only use the handbrake for the next two minutes. No regular braking, handbrake only for the next two minutes. GT Adam's gonna need to pit the next lap, has only got handbrake only. Dak Dak, are you gonna join us tomorrow night? Ooh, GT Adam's gone round. The handbrake only sabotage has paid price. Good effort though, and well saved actually. Um, Hopping on a bus home, probably gonna hard lag. Don't worry about it, Jenko. Just come back when you can, honey. You'll still have plenty of time for the race. We've got 20 minutes after this race. Naterade has moved into the lead. Five seconds into the lead. Kitty has caused, has just gone past GT Adam, who's got handbrake only. We're watching him making his way around the course. Doing really well, to be fair. It's not an easy sabotage. It's first ever race in TTT as well. I know, Mum. I know. You should. My honestly, I, I have a headache every time I finish this. <laughs> Naterade, five point five seconds in the lead. What can we do? I'm gonna spin this wheel in a minute. It's gonna be Naterade. I don't know. GT Adam, I've had someone who's watching ask if you're on controller or wheel. Is Adam in this chat? Maybe no mic, maybe no mic, okay. We don't know, once I find out I'll let you know. I was spinning the wheel. Yeah, you might just not have a mic, it's okay. Okay, need a raid. Wet tires please. The need a raid's got to go in for wet. Kitty, Matt, Fred and Nevi. You do too and you can only hear Romeo, yeah. Honestly, it's it can be heavy in my ears. That's why you'll often see me with this ear free. I can actually hear my own thoughts. My left ear is like slowly going deaf. Oh, Adam's on control. He's managed to type whilst driving. Are you in the pit? You must be in the pits. Oh, he's in the pits. I was going to say, bloody hell, that's some skill. Naderade is going to have to box. We'll not get stacked on. Kitty has claws. We'll get the next sabotage. Controller. We've got quite a few fast controller players in here. Romeo has a new name. Chocolate Salty Balls. Suck on my chocolate salty. I probably can't do that, can I? Found the cars on Discord. Nice, legend, nice. Well, you're welcome to join us. You're welcome to join us tomorrow night. It'll be 9 p.m. UK time. 
Wheel of Doom will spin again in 20 seconds. Where we say a lot of times I have to yell at him, shut up. Mum, honestly, please go pull his hairs, pull his armpit hairs, and make him go slower. <laughs> Glad him doesn't get penalised for typing whilst in the pits. Hmm, interesting. Yeah, you did it whilst driving, Joker. It's different. Okay, here comes the Wheel of Doom. It's gonna be kitty, 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 kitty. Hey, kitty, 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 kitty. Kitty, 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 kitty. Wow! <laughs> Instant three sixty, please. GG's kitty, you did get all the way around. It took you three places back though. You might have someone to tell Jenny stop bitching. Jenny's a bitch. No, the group chat's crazy. The you, the group chat is uh, is loud. Nine PM in my country. Nine PM. Twenty one hundred hours. Tomorrow night. I bitch if I want to. Matt is the new race leader. Fred's getting slowed down with a one second. Romeo is up in third with his winning livery car here. The Marlboro car. He's picked up ten extra points today as our Rome. Can everyone stop bitching? <laughs> In Germany it's now 3pm. Now it's 2pm. Here. So it'll be 10pm in Germany tomorrow night. First race. That'll be quite late. 10pm for you, 9pm for me. Jenny is the bitch of bitching. Yeah, Jenny can shut the f up. Truthfully. She's always going at me, is Jenny. Yeah, that's fine, Legend. I understand. The next one will be Thursday. Uh, 11, uh, so 12pm for you. 11am for me. Yeah, no, no, that's fine. If you're free in the daytime, next Thursday will be the next one, which will be a, a 12 lunchtime for you. Wheel of Doom is spinning. It's going to be Matt's. Matt, only fifth gear, please. Only fifth gear, please. I'm very confused. Who's Jenny Tiny? Jenny is Jenko. Jenny's always bitching at me. Yeah. Junko is Jenny. Drew. Nevi's in the grass here. No, Nevi, no, Nevi, no, Nevi, no, Nevi. Get it back, get it back, get it back. Okay, Nevi's back. Romeo's coming in hot behind him, though. Kitty and Mrs. Romeo as well. All looking to try and scalp some of these places back. One minute till the next wheel spin. Matt is in the lead by four seconds. Fred is in second, third for Drew. Nevi up it. Oh my goodness, what just happened? Jesus. Romeo just turned into a parrot in my ears. What just happened there, guys? It wasn't even that dramatic. Just they went like three wide at that point. The fastest lap here is a 120.2 at the moment and it is set by GT Adam who is in night has been sabotaged and is trying to play catch up. So we're going to spin the wheel again. Miss Ashley started it. Okay. Oh, these sabotages have been nice, which means... Which means the end of the race might be drama, which is what we love. Matt. Only second gear until the next sabotage, please. I love the poppy sounds. They're very therapeutic. GG. 
you know what Kitty's just suggested in the group chat that we have a, one sabotage on the wheel that says turn PlayStation off. Can you imagine? Can you imagine? They do sound good. They do sound good. The little boom, 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 boom. they're very very good. Can you imagine telling someone to? Because they'd leave the group chat as well. So they would literally just have to sit there in silence for a minute and then they'd have to reboot. Oh my god. Some people just want to watch the world burn. That would be so mean. Fred in the lead now. Drew is in second. Matt is in third with a half second. Katie playing catch up. GC Adam now up into fifth. GC Adam's been solid. Fastest start with a 120.2. Romeo misses Romeo and Damo chasing in behind here for the top five spaces. I love the little pops. I do love the little pops. The little brum, 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 they go down gears. The last sabo before the end of the race, full denied from racing down. That would be rough. Can you imagine? Can you imagine? Just like turn your PlayStation off. You're literally 10 seconds before the end of the line. Turn the PlayStation off. <laughs> should we do that? Should we add that in? That should be. That might be hilarious. I need to think about this. Let's spin the wheel. Just turn your PlayStation off. Oh, it's going to be Fred here. Fred's just sits in front of Drew. Oopsie daisy. What do we got here? 100k channel points. Okay, yeah, okay. Yeah, we could do that actually. Fred, reverse for two minutes, please. Fred is round. Drew has gone into the. Yeah, we could do it for channel redeemed rather than the wheel. We could do it for, yeah, that would be a better idea. Fred is going backwards around this track here. Kitty has falls, we'll look to take him. Thing is, no one will save 100,000 channel points because people struggle to save 10k channel points. And they, as soon as people get 10k channel points, they want to spend them on the instant sabo. So I don't know if anyone will ever save to turn someone's PlayStation off. It would be like once a year. Your mom with 100 biddies! Get your biddies out. Get your biddies out. Get your biddies out. Get your biddies out. Thank you so much for those 180 biddies. Big old tig old biddies. Thank you so much. We've got a minute till the next sabotage here. Saving in the off season. So he says, yeah. Yeah, I guess you've got three months of the year. Which, which person would you sab, Ashley? Miss Ashley. Sorry, I do have to say your name like that. I hope you don't mind. Miss Ashley. Make it 30k. Yeah, make it like realistic, but it's a big, it's a big sabo, isn't it? We have an instant sabo on Drew from the Banana Man. Let's go. They stream for three months. I can't not do that. Sorry. Okay, it's not horrific, but it's only second gear for Drew for the next two minutes, so till 32... Uh, just before 32 minutes. And the wheel's spinning again now for Drew. So Drew's stuck in second gear. Okay, Drew, once you've finished in second gear for two full minutes, only fifth gear for two full minutes. Oh dear, that should slow you down. Banana with the Sabby. So Drew has been stacked on here. So Drew's stuck in second gear for two full minutes and then fifth gear for two full minutes. I couldn't not. I could not stream for a month, but I could not stream for three months. That would be too much. I did actually take a month off last year, do you remember? It was in September. I took all of September off. We got to the end of the August TTT and I needed the break. And then when we came back for the winter TTTs, I had, I had a really good break. Oh, when I came back, um, I got really ill. It sucked. I had a whole month off and I got ill just as I came back for TTT. Nader Raid has gone round. Drew is very much still in the lead. Three seconds is the gap, but GT Adam coming in hot. This should slow Drew down enough, but who knows. 
You see Adam Hasdale taking the lead, picked up a half second cutting pen here, one and a half in the lead from Drew. Romeo's going to try and take second place here. Wheel of Doom's coming in soon. After this one, we've got them every one minute. Or you could do a big amount of points to redeem to remove points from the races that you feel the situation. Oh my god. Oh, I don't know about that one. That one could ruffle some feathers. DT Adam, welcome to TTT. Please drop to the back. I'm so sorry. You can go the wrong way around the track to drop to the back if you didn't know. You can turn around and go backwards. <laughs> Naterade has taken the lead here. Damo in second, Mrs. Romeo in third. Can we all just calm off arms, please? Matt, what, what were you shouting at? I'm on replay and I can't see anything. Oh, right, okay, fine, fine, fine. No, Matt was just shouting, but I thought it's because something happened. It was just because he picked up a three second for cutting uh, for the yellow flag, for overtaking you in the yellow flag. That's all it was. GT Adam. Has oh God, GT Adam's fallen right to the back. Jesus, we got sabos every one minute now, though. GT Adam's fallen seven seconds behind the last place. One minute four to catch up, that's a big ask. Naterade is in the lead. Wheel of Doom is gonna spin. What have we got? Okay, Naterade. I've got to do it on the two minute mark. Inters, please. That's why I had to wait for the two minute part. Yeah, that's why I had to do it. I had to wait. <clears throat> so Matt, Mrs. Rome, the sabotage is at every one minute now. Really quiet in the back unless I get a bad sabo. You felt like you're gonna be in the, this is what I mean, you keep talking like you're gonna be in the back. Um, GT Adam is now trying to close down the time. It's taken it down from 1 minute 4 to 90, uh, 59 seconds, 58 seconds and dropping. So GT Adam has got some really good place and he's got 5 minutes to try and play catch up. So it is possible. The Wheel of Doom's going to spin again. Yeah, but you always say you're going to be really bad and then you, like, you come like third or something. Need a raid. Racing mediums after that, please. <laughs> Sorry, Need a raid. It's a double pit for Need a raid. It's a double pit for Need a raid. Yeah, that's because you forgot to fuel three times or something crazy. <laughs> Matt, Mrs. Romeo, Kitty. Kitty. There's everyone sort of poised here. Naterade's got a double pit. Matt's going to take the lead here. Mrs. Romeo's going to take second. Kitty's going to take third. Romeo is nine seconds off the podium spots. Anna's got a decel with Drew right behind him here. Nevi getting slowed down at the penalty line as well. Okay, we're spinning the wheel of doom again. It's going to be Matt's. Matt, you need to box for mediums, please. Another penalty in one minute. I'm 
I'm keeping all eyes on GT Adam. GT Adam has taken his deficit from 1 minute and 4 to 43 seconds. 42 seconds. The time is constantly dropping for GT Adam here. I'm wishing him well for his first CCT race, of course. Let's spin the wheel again. Okay, we've got another sabotage here. It's, mm, it might not go to Matt, actually. It will go to Matt. Matt? Stop, start. And the pit for your tyres, thank you. Here comes Mrs. Romeo and here, kitty, 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 kitty. Here comes Naderade out the pits on Intus has got to pit once again. It could be the end of Naderade's race here. Mrs. Romeo still holding the lead. 15 seconds until the next Sabo. Kitty on the inside. Kitty goes into the lead once again. What have we got for Kitty here? Side by side racing between these two girlies. Kitty, you need to box for mediums, please. Mrs. Romeo and Romeo looking to take first and second. Then we've got Drew and Fred here. For oh! Well held, Romeo. Well held, Romeo. Let's have a quick replay on Fred there. Ro Fred went for a little dive bomb down the inside and fell straight into Romeo. Look, boosh. Luckily, Romeo held on. We've got another little wiggle, 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 wiggle here. Oh no, guys. Look what it is. Look what it is. I'm going to make sure I get this on the two minute mark here. Brad dropped to the back. I'm sorry, Fred. I feel bad for that one. He's like the nicest guy. Drew, Damo, and Romeo. Thank you so much for the follow, Spazzy Attacks. I know, Miss Ashley, I'm so sorry. I feel awful. Okay, we're going to spin the wheel ready. Because this is going to be close to the line again. Ooh, look at this. Oh! Drew's gone into the barrier. Matt's gone into the lead. Matt, you need to box for inters. Matt, you need to box for inters. This could be a Mrs. Romeo win! Is this going to be a Mrs. Romeo win? Matt's in the pits! No, Matt's won! Matt's won! Mrs. Romeo's second, Drew's taken third, and Nemi's taken fourth! Romeo is up in fifth. Naterade, Demo, Kitty, the fluff. GT Adam in tenth. Woo! Matt took it. Matt took it. The uh, the the line is so close on the pit line that he took it. If that had been a bigger pit, that would have been a Mrs. Romeo win. 
But we have a few TIAs on this one, guys. We have a few TIAs. So before I give out the points, we're going to have to have a look at the TIAs. We have a few TIAs to go through now. So can we do it quickly? So what a TIA, guys? It's like the FIA, but the turnip version. And it's, if someone thinks their race has been impacted... They ask me to review it at the end. So that is what I'm now going to do. And you can all help me. You can see the footage for yourself on your screen. Yeah, well done, Adam, for your first race. I'm sorry you got absolutely beasted at the end there. But well done for your first race. If you want to join us ever again, it's every Thursday, 11 a.m. till 3 p.m. UK time. But we actually have one tomorrow night as well, which will be 9 p.m. UK time as well. If you want to come back tomorrow night and do it all again, you can. We've got Kyoto Miyabi in the Daihatsu Copen, Autopolis in the Shelby GT350R, and Big Willow in the Alpine A10. A110. A110. Have we got have we got anyone doing the footage? No, I just didn't know if I'd missed it, that's all. I'm good, boiling point long time. Let's see how are you doing? Okay, guys, this is TIA. This is where people have, have been annoyed about something that's happened in the race and we review it at the end. Okay, so what's the first incident? So I can tell the audience. Demo on Fred at the hairpin of lap 12. Demo Fred at the hairpin of lap 12. Okay. Can we go back? Can we actually just go back? Okay. So where did where was he and where did he end up as a result of being spared? Oh, actually, Damo was asked to go back two corners because he gets punted by Fred clean into Narnia. Where was the contact? Two, two. I can't see the contact right now. Oh, no, not that one. Sorry, Fred. He says, sorry, Fred. Too many in the same car. It wasn't you, Fred. Okay, so where was... Going back to the incident that we were discussing, where were you and where did you end up as a result? Damo redresses, so yeah, no further action. That doesn't affect the race. Okay, next. And I'm not saying that you haven't been wronged, I'm just saying it's not easy for me to then award points at this point in the race when there wasn't that much issue in terms of placement.
Okay. Any more incidents? Yeah, but are these ones that have affected people's outcome? Okay, okay, okay. Just checking, just because the last two haven't. No more races left boiling point. We are just finalising the points for this race and then we'll be back. We're on 26 right now, aren't we? Oh, sorry, okay. okay. Yeah, no, that would be, that is helpful actually. Okay, what was that? Go back. Damo and Romeo here. Have a look. Where's... How did that even happen though? Go on demo cam. Go on demo cam. That is such a weird movement. That is such a weird movement. No, that is so bonkers though. That doesn't, that looks weird. That's not him. Cause he's not, he doesn't change his input. Demo says netcode, Romeo lag jump. Adam, not gonna lie, that's the most fun I've had on this game in a while. Adam, well, you're welcome to join us every time, honestly. Congratulations, on your first race. I know you ha you had some you had some of the worst sabotages on your first race. It it doesn't get worse than that though, Adam. Just know. His demo says he felt like he got hit from behind when that happened, and that's how it looks on the screen, to be honest. No, he jerks too fast. It's not wheel spin that. Right, we're doing we're doing nothing on the uh, we're doing nothing on that one there with the weird jump because that's. Okay, now what's this? This is who on Kitty? Okay. Who did you get sent by? Yeah. Okay, Damo sent you off from third down to where? Six. Hmm. Yeah, no worries, Adam. No worries. Welcome to the turnip patch. Okay. Are you sure? So is there any more incidents to look at actual points here? Okay. Let me go out the two. I thought we did that, no? Did we not? Okay, let's see. Go back, go back, go back. Look, sorry, Kitty. Okay, we've got one more incident to review and then we're going to finish up the stream. I 
me. Go back again. Go back a little bit, like 10 seconds. Due to Jerome, guess he's complaining the due to Friday, so let's see. I think at the point he actually hits you, he couldn't have been in a different position, if I'm honest. Go on, Kitty, you can speak, obviously. Okay, let me give out the points. So we've got 15 points going to Matt. GG's Matt for your win. 14 points going to Mrs. Romeo. 13 points going to Drew. 12 points going to Nevi. 11 points going to Romeo. 10 points going to Natorade. Nine points going to Demo. Seven points to Fred. Six points to Adam. I've added you to my list, Adam, so your points will get updated um, in the Discord as well. And five points to Dafloof. GG's all the races. Let's have a quick chat. Yeah, Anton, I, I, I kind of agree on that one, to be honest. Okay, let me have a look at who won the prediction. Did anyone bet on that? Yeah, we had one person bet on that, and you've won 21 times your channel points back. So Drew has won 2.1k channel points on that bet. And he only put on 100. He put on 100 channel points and won 2.1k. That is bonkers. Okay. So the points for the day are as follows in no order. 39 points to Romeo, 39 points to Mrs. Romeo, 45 points to Drew, 27 points to Nevi, 37 points to Matt, 34 points to Fred, 27 points to Naterade, 28 points to Damo, 32 points to Kitty, 23 points to Floof, and 6 points to Adam. I will... um. Get the points up uh, ASAP. We've got the total points as well to do. So keep your eyes on the Discord and we will see you tomorrow night. So tomorrow night we've got Kyoto Miyabi in the Diazzo Copen, Autopolis in the Shelby GT350R and Big Willow in the Alpine A110. I always keep getting that wrong so I'm just calling it out like that. Yeah, no, I keep getting it wrong. And then... Um, we will see you at 9 p.m. for the first race. So I'll be live maybe 8.30, quarter to nine, and the first quality will go off at 9 p.m. UK time. So that's GMT time if you're looking to convert. Muntin Raul, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the stream. I am just about to go, but hopefully I can catch you another time. I'm gonna raid out now, guys. Who are we gonna go to?
Okay, we are going to raid out. So thank you so much for all the love today once again. And we... Oh, Fred, no! I'll get you next time, Fred. I'm sorry, honey. I'm sorry, honey. Sorry, honey. I'd already pressed it. I didn't need... Oh, sorry, Fred. I'll catch you next time, honey. We are going to Scruff, though. We are going to Scruff, though. So let's get the turnips in the chat. Blow up his stream. Bless his day. And I will see you all soon, turnips.